So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika! Hi, it's me, Mika. And today we are at Southern Hill Farms in Claremont, Florida. This farm is so cool because they grow flowers and they grow fruit. So today I want to pick some blueberries, make blueberry lemonade, and find some beautiful sunflowers. I love sunflowers because they're yellow. One of my favorite colors. Come with me. that you can use to collect the blueberries in once they're picked. <laughs> That's so fun. Oh, come down here, look at this. <laughs> Have you ever seen sand on a farm before? <laughs> yeah, you might not expect sand at a farm, but this sand that's really soft and fine, it's called sugar sand, and it's really helpful for the blueberries. With this sand, the water can drain quickly, which is super important because blueberries do not grow in a lot of water. So this sand's really fun to play with and touch, but it's really important for the blueberries. So I'll just leave that there. <laughs> do you want to pick blueberries with me? Let's go. Take a look at this. It's a blueberry bush or a shrub. Here, come a little closer. See, there's, oops. <laughs> a stem, and the leaves, and look, the fruit, the best part. <laughs> so, see how some of these berries, they're different colors. There's kind of a purple, a blue, and a green. Do you know which berry is ripe? <laughs> That's right, this one, the blue one. Those are the ones that you wanna pick. And ripe means that it's fully grown and ready to eat. <laughs> They're so cute. I know, we could pick 20 ripe blueberries. Will you count with me? Cool. So we have one. Hmm. Oh, here's another one. Two. Ooh, there's one down here. Three, four, Almost there. 17. 18. 19. 20. 20 ripe blueberries. Thanks for counting with me. See, you can pick them off of the bush or you can pick them up off the ground as long as they're nice, blue, and ripe. <laughs> oh. This is gonna be really good in my blueberry lemonade. You can do all sorts of things with blueberries. What do you like to do with blueberries? You could make jam or jelly for a blueberry and peanut butter sandwich, or you can make a smoothie, blueberry pancakes, cupcakes, parfaits, juice. There's so much you can do with blueberries. <sighs> Should we keep looking at blueberries? All right, cool. Let's go over there, there's more. Wow, look, it's a baby blueberry shrub. See, it's much smaller than the other plants we saw, but one day it's gonna grow nice and big and full and have a ton of blueberries on it. You'll notice on the young plants, they have little flowers, see? <laughs> so cute. Oh, I see another ripe blueberry. Here, take a look. See how? Kind of looks white on the outside? That's called bloom. And bloom is like a sunblock for blueberries. 
It protects it against the sun so the blueberries don't get too much sun. Check it out, a really big yellow slide. I have to go down. I put my blueberries down so I don't spill any and I'm nice and safe. Come on. Whoa, I get it. You use the potato sack to go down the slide. See, you put your feet in here in the bottom, get situated and then you woo, woo, woo. <laughs> Oh, look at this. You must be this tall to ride alone. All others must ride with an adult. All right, let's see. Oh, I think I'm tall enough to ride alone. <laughs> let's check it out. Okay. Whoa, it's really high up. This is quite the climb. This slide is gonna be awesome! Look how high we are! You can see the entire farm! <laughs> okay, only slide feet first. Okay, that was my plan anyway. All right, so you lay your potato sack down like this. You sit down and feet first. Feet will go in this little pocket here. <gasps> okay. Do you want to watch me slide all the way down to the bottom? All right, see you there. <laughs> Three, two, one, slide. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> that was so fast. That was awesome. <laughs> all right, let's put this over here. And <gasps> my blueberries. Oh, there they are. All right, come on, blueberries. And you come too, there's more fun things to do. Oh, check it out, it's a carousel. Have you ever been on a carousel before? <laughs> well, let's go. Blueberries down and go for a ride. Hmm. Oh, I love this horse. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at this yellow hair. Oh, one of my favorite colors. All right, I'm ready, horse. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, on the other side. Get to a complete stop before you get off the horse. That's the safest thing to do. And we're stop. <laughs> that was so fun. Let's see what else we can find here. Wow, this is a huge jumping pillow. <laughs> Come on, let's see. Whoa, super bouncy. Whoa, this is so fun. Oh, can you imagine if this was really a pillow? Oh, good night. Oh, oh. <laughs> Whoa, let's see, what can I do on here? Whoa, I can do one of my all time favorite things, a cartwheel. Ready? Oh, I can also do a round off. <laughs> Whoa, hey, you can jump with me. What's one of your favorite jumps? You could do this. Woohoo! You could do it on the other side. Woohoo! <laughs> I'm so excited to make blueberry lemonade. I already made a lot of lemonade right here. To make lemonade, you need lemons and you need sugar to make it sweet because lemons are pretty sour and you need some water. But 
I think we need one more lemon to go into this lemonade. So let me cut one here. I'll show you how you get the juice out. And remember, only grown-ups should be using knives. Okay, so cut this in half, like that, and this is a juicer. We're gonna add that to the picture that I already made before. Yum! Okay, and my favorite part, we have some juice from the blueberries that you helped me pick earlier. We washed the blueberries and we juiced them and now I have some yummy blueberry juice to add to this lemonade. All right. Whoa, <laughs> isn't that such a pretty color? All right, now we'll take a spoon and stir it up. Mmm, smells sweet and fruity. Hey, I think that's pretty good. And I have a cup here so I can taste it. I have to make sure it tastes good. All right, whoops. <laughs> and, oh, I should add some extra blueberries to make it really special. Mmm. Okay, let's see. Oh, that's really, really tasty. Oh, I love blueberries so much. Okay, so, I picked blueberries, I made blueberry lemonade, What's the other thing that I wanted to do? <gasps> Find sunflowers, that's right. I wonder if there are sunflowers around here. I have these binoculars. They'll help me look a little closer. Let's see. Hmm. Where are the sun? <gasps> I see sunflowers down there. Let's get a closer look. Come on. There's a really big one down here. Wow, it's so pretty. See, the inside looks like the sun and the petals all around look like sun rays. Isn't that cool? Like a big, beautiful sunshine. And speaking of sunshine, did you know that sunflowers are attracted to the sun? So if the sun is shining over here, a sunflower will look like this. <laughs> and if the sun is shining over there, the sunflower will look like this. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh, they're so beautiful. So I think we did everything that we planned. Let's see. We picked blueberries, we made blueberry lemonade, and we found sunflowers. <laughs> we did it. Thank you for your help. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> well, we'll see you next time. Bye. Hi, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at O2B Kids in Orlando, Florida. This place is really fun. They have games, they have dance classes, and I want to learn some new dance moves. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, Mika. I'm Trudy. Welcome to O2B Kids, the new learning playground. Oh, thank you so much. So I want to learn some new dance moves today. Mr. Christian is available for a dance lesson right now. Really? Where is it? You can head to the theater. Oh, let's go to the theater. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, I'm Mr. Christian. I'm the dance teacher here. Wow, a dance teacher? Could you give me a dance lesson? Sure, but first, what moves do you want to learn? Oh, 
I want to learn a hip hop move, a break dance move, and a ballet move. Awesome, awesome. But first, before we do that, we have to go warm up and stretch, okay? Oh yeah, makes sense. Where do we do that? Follow me. Oh, okay. Follow Mr. Christian. Oh, I'm so excited to get started. Me too. All right, first we're going to warm up. Oh, it's so important to warm up your body before you dance, get your muscles loose and warmed up so you don't get hurt. Absolutely. All right, so first we're going to run in place and count to eight. Oh yeah, you count to eight in dance because you can easily break up the sections in music when you're learning dance moves. And you don't have to count too high. Absolutely. All right, ready? Okay. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Stop. Oh, I'm already warming up. Awesome. All right, so next thing, we're gonna do our pizza stretch, okay? I love pizza. Me too. Okay? Okay. So we gotta go into our straddle. We're gonna sit on the ground. We're going to our straddle. We're okay. gonna spread our legs out. All right, you can sit on the ground too. All right, and we're going to roll our dough out. So we're gonna roll our dough. And we're going to pat, 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 all around. Pat, 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 pat. There you go. And then we're going to pour our sauce all around. Ooh. And then we're gonna spread our sauce, spread our sauce. Awesome, awesome. And then we're going to sprinkle our cheese. Ooh. Sprinkle our and cheese. if you're dairy free, you can use dairy free cheese. Cheese with no dairy. There you go. And then we're going to put our toppings. Ooh. I'm gonna put chicken on mine because I okay, love chicken. Okay, I'm gonna put some mushrooms and ooh, green pepper. Ooh, I'm gonna put some pineapples on ooh. there. Mm -hmm. That sounds yummy. Yeah. All right, and then we're going to put our other mittens on. Yep, okay. mm -hmm. protect Just, ourselves. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to take the pizza, we're going to put it in the oven. So we're going to open the oven door. We're going to put the pizza in there. We're going to close the door. And then we're going to count to eight. Okay. Ready? We're going to go one, two, two three, four, four. Five, six, six seven, seven, eight. eight. Ding, 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 ding. It's ready. Fast cooking pizza. Yeah. So we're going to take it out, open the door. Take out the pizza. All right, ready? And three, two, one. Oh, it's so hot. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry. Awesome, awesome. All right, and we're going to put our feet together. And next, our final warm up. We're going to put our feet together. All right, and we're going to say hi, toes. Hi toes. Goodbye toes. Goodbye toes. Hi toes. Hi toes. Goodbye toes. Goodbye toes. Hi toes. Hi toes. I quickly grab them before they go away. Wait. And count yeah. to eight. One, One two, two, three, four, four five, five, six, six seven, seven, eight. eight. Yay! Oh, I feel really good now and warmed up. Awesome. I'm well, ready to dance. You ready? Let's mm -hmm. go. Okay. Come on. Let's go learn some dance moves. Whoa, we are in a real dance studio. This is awesome. I can't believe you are gonna teach me hip hop moves, break dance moves, and ballet moves. You know a lot about dance. What do you love most about it? There's just so many things about dance I love, but a few things that I love are that I can use one side of my mind, which is the logic side, and the other side of my mind, which is the creative side, and put them together through my movements. Also that it's a form of self-expression. Oh, yeah. So you can really express yourself through the movements. And also it's a sense of community. It's really about love and sharing that with everyone. Oh, that's so cool. I also like to express myself through music and dance. It's such a fun way to just be yourself and let loose and have fun. Yeah. <laughs> and you especially do that in hip hop, right? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Oh, what are the hip hop moves we're gonna learn? Okay, so our first move is our step touch, step touch. Okay. And when we do that, we're gonna count to eight, okay? Oh you yeah, ready? count to eight, I remember. All right, so first we gotta step out with our right foot. Okay. One, and step together, two. Mm -hmm. And step out with your left, one. Step together, two. And then repeat Step. that. Yep. Touch. I did. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Step touch. Okay. So we're gonna do that a little faster. Okay. Okay. Ready? Yep. Five, six, seven, eight. One, One two, two, three, four, five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Good job. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> awesome. All right. So next, we're gonna do the same thing. Okay. But we're gonna add arms to make it look really cool. Whoa. You ready? Okay. All right. 
five, six, seven, eight. One, two, two three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. Wow, that did look yeah. cool. <laughs> awesome. All right, so after that, we're gonna do our top rock. And oh. our top rock is a really cool move because it's their basic move for break dancing. Okay, so we are learning a basic move of break dance. So yeah. awesome. <laughs> okay, so first, you're gonna take your right arm. Okay. So right hand over, and then your left hand under. Oop. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna step out with your right foot, and okay. your heels gonna point up to the sky. And then our arms are gonna go out like you're about to give a big hug. Oh yeah, Yeah. Hug. Okay, and then we're gonna repeat it to the other side. We're gonna step out with the right. We're gonna, put, we're gonna switch our hands over, left over, right under. And then we're gonna kick out with our left foot and our toes point up at the sky again. And we're gonna make a big hug one more time. Ah, Ooh, big hug. There you go, good job. Nice. You think we can do it a little faster? Yeah, let's try All it. Right. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, One two, two, three. three. Four, five, five six, six, seven, eight. eight. Yes, oh, good so job. Fun. Thank yeah. you. All right, and our next move to make it a little more flavor and Ooh, put our feet on it, yes. we're gonna do a crisscross. You ready? Crisscross, what's that? Okay, so it's pretty pretty simple, okay? So your feet are kind of shoulder width apart. Okay. And think of it like a scissor, okay? okay. You're like your chopping paper, okay? You go, so you're gonna go cross with your right, over your left. I know it's a little confusing, but we'll go through very slow, okay? okay. We're gonna go right foot, shoo, shoo, and we're gonna cross, shoo. Oh, it is like yeah. scissors, like and you're cutting yeah. paper. Exactly. And then we're gonna switch it to switch feet. So you're gonna go left or right, ready? Mm -hmm. Five, six, seven, eight, shoo, shoo. and switch. Shoo. Yeah, there you go. Do a little faster. Okay. All right, ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Shoo. Yes, good job. <laughs> Thank you. That's awesome. All right, after that, we're gonna move into our ballet. Oh yeah, I really love that ballet. Yeah. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put our feet together. Okay. Okay. And we're gonna put our heels turned out. Okay. You see your toes or heels are kissing each other and going okay. mwah. Awesome. And we're gonna put our arms into our beach ball like this. Okay. Ooh, mm -hmm. All right. And we're gonna count, we're gonna count to eight one more time. We're gonna go one, two, two three, four, four five, five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Good job. Okay? okay. And that is called our plie. Oh, and that means to bend in French. There you go. So we're gonna do it just a little bit faster. Is that okay? Okay. All right. Five, six, seven, eight. One, one two, two, three, four, four five, five, six, seven, seven eight. eight. Good job. Great. Thank you. Awesome. Okay. And then to add a little more spice flavor to Love our it. ballet, uh -huh. we're gonna do some tendus, okay? Oh, and tendu means to stretch in French. There you go. So we're gonna do our tendus to the side. We're gonna start on our right side. We're gonna do it four times. And we're gonna go one with our right toe out. Uh -huh. And we're just gonna bring it. One more time. Out. Boop. Bring it. Out. Boop. Out. Bring it. Out. Out. In. In. Good job. Thank you. You're welcome. And now we're gonna go to the other side, okay? Okay. So your hands are still on your hips like this. Mm -hmm. And you're gonna go out with your left foot. Out. And then bring it. And go out. Out. And bring it. In. And go out. Bring it. Out. Bring it. Oh, Good job. Thank you. Wow. Can we do a little faster? Yeah, let's try right. it. Ready? Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yay! Good job! Thank you for teaching me all of those moves. Of course, of course. Are you ready to put it all together? I think so. All right. It's going to be a little faster. It might be a little challenging, but I think we can do it. I think so too. All right. You ready? Yep. All right. We're going to start with the step touch. You ready? Yes. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Arms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Top rock. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Crisscross. Two, three, dance it out. Six, seven, eight. Crisscross. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Plie. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Tendu. 
七、对、八、八、七、八、八、八、八、七、对、八、八、七、八、八、八、八、八、八、八、八、八、八、八、八、八、After that, can we freestyle and express ourselves however we want? Absolutely, that's the point of dance. Absolutely. Oh, awesome! I think I'm ready to do a performance. <gasps> I'm so excited! I can't wait. Okay. All right. Let's do let's it. Let's do it. Let's okay. do it. You lead the way. All right. Let's go. <laughs> Come on. Introducing the wonderful, talented, and unique Mika. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Hello. My name is. Oh my gosh, that was so good!、Oh, thank you for teaching me all of those new dance moves. Of course, it's my pleasure.、Oh, you're a great teacher. Ah,、oh, thanks. Well, I'll see you later. All right, thanks, Mr. Christian.、You're、see、welcome. ya. Bye. Wow, we had so much fun today and really learned a lot. We learned about warming up our bodies and staying loose when we learn new dance moves. And speaking of dance moves, we learned new. Hip hop moves, break dance moves, and ballet moves, and we did a great job counting to eight. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <sighs> awesome, M E E K A H, Mika. All right, we'll see you next time. Keep dancing. <laughs> Me, Mika, and today I'm at Play Day in Brooklyn, New York. Today is all about fashion and style, which I love because fashion helps you express your personality. Check out my outfit. I have two of my favorite colors: purple and yellow. Oh, and I love accessories like my jam pack and my watch. And because today is really sunny, I have one of my favorite accessories: sunglasses. Hello. <laughs> I feel so cool in my sunglasses, and I heard I get to put more things on my outfit inside. Come with me. Hi, I'm Mika. What's your name? Hi, Mika. Nice to meet you. My name is Laura. Welcome to Play Day. Oh, thank you. What kind of things can I do here? Oh, we have so many awesome classes. You can do painting, sculpture, cartooning, architecture, and fashion design. <gasps> Design. That's what I'm interested in. I want to add some things to my outfit. Great. So the first thing we can do is start with a mood board. Have you ever made a mood board? Yeah, I've made a mood board before. A mood board is a board of pictures and colors and words that inspire you. Okay, great. So let's get started. Follow、right, me. Come on. Wow, this is a big board. Well, Mika, this is your mood board, and here are all the materials that you can use. And here is your apron. <gasps> Thank you so much. So have fun, and I'll come check on you in a bit. Okay, thanks. See you soon. Whoop! Oh, I'm so excited to make this mood board. Okay, let's see what we have. <gasps> Whoa! Look at all of these colorful balls. Ooh, those are really fun. <gasps> There's some paint. Hmm. What should I start with? <gasps> Crowns. Oh, I'm gonna start with purple. One of my favorite colors. Hello again. Hey. What do you think? It looks great. Can you tell me a little about what you made? Sure, I'd love to. So I put the word confident on here because confident is the feeling I feel when I wear this outfit. 
and I have music notes because I love to sing and dance, and I have a big purple M because M is the first letter of my name, Mika, and it's purple, one of my favorite colors. I think we're ready for our next step. I think we have enough inspiration, so we should do a sketch now. Oh, a sketch! I know what that is because I'm such a planner. Fashion designers will use a sketch to help them plan what they want to make. Okay, so let's go. Follow All right, me. Come on. Wow, this is cool. So one way to make a sketch is by tracing your body on the chalkboard. And then, based on your mood board, you can add all the elements that you want to put on your garment. Wow, what a good idea! Okay, Mika, can you please lean against the chalkboard? Oh, yeah. Thank you. All right. Yeah, for fashion designers, it's super helpful to plan and sketch out a idea or design before you make something. Ooh. <laughs> all right, how's it looking? I can't wait to see. Okay, Mika. Ready? Yes. All right. <gasps> yes, I love it. I'm feeling inspired already. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now you can add the elements to your design and I will meet you at the sewing station. Okay, see you there. Bye. Thank you. Okay, so first I think I'm going to draw the outfit I'm wearing right now. So what am I wearing? What do you see? Yeah, my purple t-shirt. So let me find some purple here. Whoa, look how big this chalk is. It looks like a potato. <laughs> All right, so let's see. T-shirt, short sleeves. Okay, that. All right, I'm gonna color it in. And do you notice anything else on my purple shirt? Yeah, I have some yellow on there. Whoa, look at this piece of chalk. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do some yellow here on the sleeves. And yellow here. And where else is there yellow? Up here, around my neck there. Some yellow. And I have a yellow pocket. <laughs> right side. Ooh. Okay, what else do I have? Purple shirt and my jeans. Okay, I'll use the color blue. All right, and you can see a little bit of my ankle, so I'm gonna cut them down here so I have room for my shoes. I'm gonna color them in blue. Okay. Blue jeans, my purple shirt, and oh, my accessories. I have a compass watch that's purple and yellow. So I'm gonna use this purple again. And let's see. There's yellow on it too. Oh, I'm feeling like such a little designer. <laughs> Okay, let's see if I can copy it. There's a little yellow there. There's a little yellow there. And the rest is purple. And there's a white circle in the middle. Can you see it? It's really tiny. Okay, that. And then check out my bracelets. There's blue, yellow, purple, orange. Wow, that's a lot of different colors. So we get some purple on there, blue, and ooh, a little orange. Okay, and yellow. Awesome, and oh, speaking of yellow, I have a yellow bow in my hair. Oh, I should draw my hair. It's brown and curly. Can't really tell what color this is. Let's find out. Ooh, look at those curls. Go on, Mika. Woo. Okay, okay. And then I'll put my yellow ribbon here. Mika, 
You look amazing. All right, and I have some white and purple and yellow ugh, shoes. Okay. Whoa. Okay, some shoes. And hmm, I feel like something is missing. I have my bow, my shirt, my jeans, my accessories. <gasps> my jam pack! Oh, I forgot my super fun jam pack. Okay, let's see. I need blue and orange. And there's a white circle in the middle. Hmm, just like my compass watch. Okay, so I need orange and blue. And I'll use this black to draw the strap. And then the big circle. Okay, so there's blue on top. And blue on the bottom. These two are orange. And there's the white button in the middle. Okay, yes. She's looking great. <laughs> okay, so I want to add something, I think, to my shirt. There is something on my mood board that got me really excited. Do you know what it is? It's the letter M for Mika. I think it would look so cool if there was a purple letter M right there on my pocket. So let's see if I'm right. Oh, it's kind of hard to see. Yes! Yes, that's what I want. The letter M sewn onto my shirt. That way my outfit will look super complete. And I think I'll just add some little bedazzle here on my bag for fun. And I forgot my face. <laughs> All right, the eyes, the nose, and a giant smile. Twins. <laughs> All right, let's go over to the sewing station so I can get my M put on my shirt. Come on. Hey! Hi, Mika. I'm so excited to be at the sewing station. Welcome. I have the sewing kit ready for you. <gasps> do you decide what to do with your design? Yes, I'm so excited. I want to add a purple M to my shirt. That's great. So I'm going to give you another shirt so you can change. Oh, cool. All right, thanks. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Hi, Mika. Hi, thank you for the shirt. You're welcome. <laughs> so I have my shirt here ready for the letter M. That's great. So first thing we're gonna do is talk about the materials that we oh. will be using. Yeah, there's a lot here. So for sewing, we use needles, mm -hmm. plastic needles for kids, and sharp needles for adults. Whoa. So make sure that you have a grown-up with you when you're using those sharp needles. Yeah, good idea. We also use thread and scissors. Oh, so needles, thread, and scissors. Got it. Perfect. So to Thread the needle. We're going to pass the yarn or thread through the eye of the needle. Oh, oh I bet the eye is right here on top. That is See thread. that opening? Ooh, that looks <laughs> kind of difficult. <laughs> so don't worry, I have a trick for it. Okay. You can fold your yarn mm -hmm. so that way it's easier to pass through the needle. Oh, smart. Okay. Perfect. So next, you're going to choose the color that you're going to use. Hmm, there are a lot of great colors. Oh, I think I want to use orange. I love this color. <laughs> Perfect. So now, we're going to cut the thread. Okay. To measure, you hold it with your fingertips. Where's the end? Where there it is. <laughs> <laughs> and then pull it to your elbow. Okay. Ooh. And that's a perfect size to start. Nice. You want to cut it? Yes. Team work. Love it. So now we're going to make a knot on one of the ends of our thread. Can you make a knot here? Yes, perfect. And we're going to call that the tail. Whoop. Got a little tail. And now you can thread your needle. Okay, should I try your trick? Yes. Okay, just like the professionals do it. <laughs> I'm going to be very careful because the end of this needle is sharp. <laughs> so close. Oh, oh, oh. 
That's fine. I can do it for you. Yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's really tricky to do. Yes, it's okay. It takes practice. I have to practice more. All right, nice. <laughs> Thanks for your help. You're welcome. So now you can start sewing. Another tip is that you hold both the needle and the thread when you're stitching. Oh. That way the thread will stay in the needle. Got it. Okay. Oh, I don't have the letter M. <laughs> no worries. I have it ready for you right here. <gasps> wow. It's exactly what I had in mind. Look, it's purple. One of my favorite colors. Oh, thank you so much for making this. You're welcome. Okay, so... I think I want it to look like this. Hold it up so you can see it. What do you think? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So cute. Okay, so hold both the needle and the thread. And you're gonna watch my fingers here because it's really sharp. And just poke a hole and then pull the needle through, right? Yes. Okay. Make sure you pass all the thread through. Whoa. Mm -hmm. Good job. I did it. My first stitch. <laughs> okay, and then go back through. Yes. Okay. Jeez, it's harder than it looks. Hi. <laughs> right. Okay, look, it's starting to stay on the shirt. Good job. Now you secure your M. Okay. Thank and you. You can add a few more stitches. Okay. Maybe I'll do one here. Okay. The final stitch. All right, now what do I do? Well, now we can cut the excess thread. Okay. I can help you. Thank you. I can take the needle. Oh, thank you. Be careful. Yes. All right. I can't believe I just did that all by myself. Great job, Mika. Thank you. What do you think? I love it. Oh, thank you so much for helping me today. You're welcome. I hope you had a good time and keep practicing everything you learned today. I will. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Mika. See you Bye. later. Bye. Okay. I can't wait to put this on. See you soon. Check it out. The letter M is on my shirt and I think it looks really good. I love it. Now my outfit is complete. Oh, and I have one more thing for fun. For my jam pack. Ooh, nice! <laughs> I had such a fun day. I got to make a mood board, a sketch, and I sewed my very own M on my shirt. This was so cool. And what's cool about fashion and style is you can express yourself through your clothes and accessories. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> All right. I'll see you later. Everyone, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Sky Zone Trampoline Park in Anaheim, California. <laughs> Woo! Look at these blocks. They're so fun and light. They're made out of foam. And look, this one is orange and oh. There's a blue one there too. And it says, welcome. <laughs> That's so nice. I'm really excited because there are trampolines here and foam pits that you can jump into. And I really want to learn how to do a flip. I wonder if there's someone here who can teach me how to do that. Let's go find out. Hi, Mika. Hi, I'm Priscilla. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Welcome to Sky Zone. Ooh, thank you. I'm so excited to be here. <laughs> awesome. Okay, first we do need to pick out some wristbands Ooh, in order to go inside the park. I love wristbands. Hmm. So which color would you like? Oh, let's see. There's orange, green, <gasps> yellow. Yellow is one of my favorite colors. I want Mine this one. too. All right, here, let's go. Thank you, so official. <laughs> and now we have to pick out some socks. Okay, why do we need to put on special socks? The special socks have grip on them so that when you're on the trampoline, you don't slip. Oh, that's so smart. Hmm, let's see, we have some orange socks and, ooh, 
some blue and black and pink socks. Hmm, I think I'm gonna go with the orange. I love this color and my best friend Blippi really loves orange. I'm gonna wear these. All right, perfect. <laughs> Thank so you. what brings you in today? Oh, I really wanna learn how to do a flip on the trampoline. All right, perfect. We have Quincy in the park who can teach you how to do a flip. Wow, okay, let's go find Quincy. Thank you. Of course. <laughs> and this huge foam pit behind me. Wow, I've never seen so many trampolines before. Will you count them with me? Awesome, let's go. Okay, ready? One, <laughs> two, three, four, five. Wow, five trampolines. I wonder where Quincy is. That's who's supposed to teach me how to do a flip. Oh, I'm so excited. Where is he though? I wonder if he's in the foam pit. Should I jump in and see? <laughs> Let's do it. Woo, wow. <laughs> Quincy. Quincy. Hmm. I don't think anyone's in here, except me. <laughs> Whoa, it says foam zone. That's where we are in this big foam zone. Check out these blocks. Look, you see a square? When there's six squares together, that makes a cube. And these are made out of foam, so it's soft, and squishy, so it feels really fun and nice to jump into a foam pit. And you don't get hurt. <laughs> Look, there's orange, blue, and black. <laughs> this is so fun. I can't wait till I learn how to do a flip. I wonder where Quincy is. <gasps> Maybe he's over there. Come on, let's go. Whoa, this is cool. But I still don't see Quincy anywhere, huh? Whoa, I know what this is. It's orange, it's round, and oh, it bounces. This is a basketball. But why would a basketball be at a trampoline park? And hey, there's a basketball hoop. <laughs> And another trampoline. I bet jumping on a trampoline and throwing a basketball into the hoop is a lot easier than if you're just on a regular ground. Oh, I'm gonna try it. Okay, let's see. On three. One, two, three. Ah, didn't get it in. Oh, here's another one. It's yellow. Maybe I'll try and throw it backwards. One, two. Three. Whoa. Oh, whoopsie. <laughs> oh, there's another one. Hmm. Maybe if I do three big bounces to the hoop, that will go in. Ready? One, two, three. Ah. There's one more ball. Okay, how should I do this one? Hmm. Maybe I'll do one giant and a turn for finesse. <laughs> Ready? One. Oh, I still didn't get it in. <laughs> That's okay. I'm gonna keep looking for Quincy. I can't wait to learn how to do a flip. <laughs> Quincy! No, Quincy. <laughs> Let's go over to the other side. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Do you know what this is? This is a balance beam. It's called that because it's a beam 
and you have to have really good balance to stand on it. Whew, you don't want to wobble and go side to side. Did you know that there are a lot of animals who have really good balance? And mostly because of their tails. <laughs> Squirrels have really good balance because of their swooshy tails. And cats, meow, meow. <laughs> and kangaroos. Yeah, kangaroos have long tails that help them balance. And they're really good jumpers. <laughs> Will you jump with me? <laughs> hey, let's jump over there. Woo! Whoa, more trampolines! Look how many are in here! Whoa! Wow! That has to be Quincy! He's so good at jumping! Whoa! Whoa! Wow, are you Hello? Quincy? I am Quincy. Hi, I'm Mika! It's nice to meet you, Mika. How nice you doing? You too. I'm having so much fun here. I'm so glad to hear that, Mika. So I heard that you are really good at flipping. You might have heard, right? Oh, well, I want to learn how to flip too. Can oh, you help me? I can take good care of you. Oh, awesome. <laughs> what do we need to do first? All right, first and foremost, we have to warm up. Oh, right. It's important to warm up our body so we don't get hurt. Exactly, Mika. Okay, so what do we need to do? So first things first, you know, we're just going to touch the ground. Oh, okay. We're just touch, touch the, the ground. ground. Oh. You know, and then we're gonna lean to the left, and then we're gonna lean it to the right. Okay. Ah. And you know, once your legs feel all good, you get some jumping jacks in. Woo! You know, you know, have some fun with it. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> wow, it's kind of like making a snow angel in the air. Exactly. Whoa! <laughs> Wow, okay, I'm feeling pretty good. I'm getting warmer and looser. All right, you feeling warm and loose? I think so. All right, let's see if you can do a jump twist then. Whoa, a jump twist. Okay, ready? Whoa, like okay. that? Just like that. Wow. Right. I got what else one can we you. do? Well, you ever done a somersault? Yeah, have you ever done a somersault before? Okay, let's do it together. All right, you know how to do a somersault, Mika? Yeah. So what are the first steps, just first as a steps, reminder? Visualize your platform. Ooh, okay. Visualize. Then you're gonna put your hands out. Okay. Oh. And fall. Okay, so hands out, and what do I do with my head? You're gonna tuck your head in like a bowling ball. Oh, tuck your head in like a bowling ball. You're gonna tuck and roll. And then become the ball. Become the ball. <laughs> Here I go. Whoa! <laughs> Just like that, Mika. That was so fun. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Okay, ready? All right. Visualize. Visualize. Head tucked. Head tucked. And become the ball. Become the ball. Oh, whoa! <laughs> that was really fun. That was really fun. Now I got a question for you. Yeah. Think you can do it in the air? Oh, I've never tried before. You want me to show you? Yes, please. All right. Well, first, you're gonna get a whole lot of air. Whoa. Whole lot of air. And then, next you're gonna do, you tuck your chin again. So once you get all that air, you're gonna tuck your chin. And remember, only try and do a flip if you're with a grown up. Whoa, did you see that? He just did a front flip in the air. That was amazing. Ah, <laughs> uh, thank you. How do you jump that high? Uh, <sighs> basketball helps. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Sometimes, you just gotta have fun with it in there. Hop over your leg. Wow! You're so good Meditate at jumping! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa! Wow! That was so fun! But Quincy, I don't know if I'm ready to do a flip in the air like you just did. Well, you gotta keep practicing, Mika, and then you'll get it. I got it. So, I have to remember to jump really high, stay in one spot, tuck my head, and go forward like a ball. Exactly, it's just like a somersault, but you're taking away the ground. Got it, thank you so much. Of course, Mika. I'm gonna take all of these things and I'm gonna practice, and then one day I'll get to do a front flip just like you, Quincy. I hope so, Mika. <laughs> thank you so much. Of course, I'm gonna go bounce now. All right, me too, see you later. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> wow, that 
that was so much fun playing and bouncing at Sky Zone Trampoline Park. <laughs> I really wanted to learn how to do a flip today, and Quincy was an amazing teacher. He knows a lot about flipping and bouncing on trampolines. Oh, and it was so fun jumping into the foam pit. The foam pit was nice and soft and squishy and oh, made out of blocks like this. Wait a second. Do you know what this says? It says, Mika. <laughs> That's me. That's my name. Well, I had so much fun playing and learning with you today. If you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Awesome. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. We'll see you next time. Bye. me, Mika, and today I'm at the Lang Foundation in Los Angeles, California. And here, you can adopt a dog or a cat, and then they can be part of your family. Oh, there's a dog right there. Oh, hi, I'm Mika. Hi, I'm Megan. Hi, Megan, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, this is Willow. Oh, hi, Willow. Oh, it's always important to ask before you pet an animal. Uh, can I pet Willow? Yes, you can. Okay. So just Crouch down so you're on her level uh -huh. and put your fist out so she can okay. smell you. Willow, Willow. Oh, what do you think? Aww. <laughs> so sweet. Well, are there more animals inside? There are. Oh, let's go check them out. So what is this little one's name? This is Sprout. <gasps> Sprout, what a cute name. Hi, Sprout. I have some treats for Sprout. Sprout allowed to have a treat? Yes, he okay. is. Let's see, you want a treat? You think Sprout likes treats? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> can we bring Sprout down to the ground? And yeah. See if Sprout will want to play with us. Oh, whoa, cool squeaky toy. It's a pink snake. <laughs> so once someone adopts an animal. What do they need to take care of the animal? Yeah, so for dogs, they need a leash, a collar, a harness, um, food, bowls, uh, and a lot of toys. Whoa! Food, bowls, toys. It's a lot of work to take care of an animal. It they is. need a lot of things. Aww, and is it different for cats? Yeah, so cats would need um, also food, bowls, uh, litter box, litter. Um, some good things to scratch on. Oh yeah, cats love to scratch. And a safe <laughs> carrier in case you need to take them to the vet. Oh wow. So you get a lot of things once you adopt an animal here. Yes, yes, we give people some of the food that they've been eating, um, some toys. And where do you get all of these toys? They have so many fun things to play with here. We get a lot of it donated. If oh, people yeah? have extra supplies, they donate them to us. And yeah, it's a big help for us. Whoa, what a great idea to donate toys for these dogs and cats to play with. <laughs> oh, what's this toy? Where did these animals come from? So we rescue these animals from city shelters. Uh, basically, the shelters are crowded with animals, so we take them and find them new homes. Oh, that's really nice. And if someone wants to adopt an animal, what do they do? So we would have them come in and meet some of the animals. They'd fill out an application, and we would help them find the right animal that matches their family. Wow, that's awesome! It's so fun to play with cats and dogs, but it's also important to remember you have to take very special care of them. Whoa, come look at this dog. Whoa, what kind of dog is this? This is an American Bully Mix. American Bully Mix, whoa. This is a bigger dog, aw. And she's so loving, what's her name? Uh, her name is Lady. Hi, Lady. Aw, so, so sweet. What's this? A blue, like a little mouse with a super long tail. <laughs> Aww. This dog is so cool. Ooh, and I love the purple leash. One of my favorite colors. Love your leash. Oh, and 
What's on her belly here? Yeah, so she's definitely had a litter of puppies. Wow, a litter of puppies? That's so cool. How many puppies do you know? Um, I don't, but I think they can have up to 10 puppies. Whoa, that's a lot of puppies. Wow. Oh, well, it was nice to meet you. Thanks for playing with us. Louise is ready for her bandage change. Okay, great. Aww. Hi. So what room is this? So this is our medical treatment area. Oh, a medical treatment area. So this is where animals go to be taken care of if they're sick or they have, maybe they hurt themselves. What's wrong with her leg? So we rescued her with a broken leg. Aww. And yeah, now she has a cast on and she's healing. Oh, good. That must mean she's feeling better. She definitely is. Yeah, I can hear some purring there. She's purring really loud. Yeah, cats purr when they're in a great mood, right? Aww. And why is she wearing a big yellow flower? She looks super cute, and yellow is one of my favorite colors. <laughs> so that's an e-collar, and it keeps her from taking her bandage off. Oh, that's so smart. And super cute. <laughs> are there other cats that we can see? There are. Oh, let's go see some more cats. Feel better. Cool. Welcome to the catio. Get it? Cat? Catio? It's the catio. <laughs> now they said that there are a lot of cats in here. Hmm. Will you help me find them? <laughs> awesome. Okay. Whoa. Look at all this. It kind of looks like something you would see at a playground. The cats can climb up here and they can scratch. <laughs> Come over here. Shh. I see a cat. Can you see it? Oh, it's sleeping. We found our first cat. Good job. Hmm. Oh, there's another cat over here. You see it? Hi, cat. That cat looks really soft. <laughs> and there's another cat. Hi, kitty. Wow, so we found one, two, three cats so far. <laughs> wow. Hmm. Do you see any other cats? <gasps> Come down here, all the way to the floor. There are two. Two cats in there. They're cuddling. I wonder if they're best friends. Oh. Hi. They're so cute. So we have one, two, three, four, five cats so far. I wonder if there's any more. Oh, wow. There's some water and some food in here. They take really good care of their cats. Hmm. Oh, look down here at these little boxes. See some blankets in here so the cats can be nice and comfy cozy. Oh, and look, it's a cutout of a cat face. That's cool. I don't see any cats though, do you? Hmm. Oh, I see one right here. Oh my goodness. Shh, this cat is taking a cat nap. Wow, it looks really comfortable. I wonder if cats have dreams. Hmm. So, one, two, three, four, five, six cats. We found six cats. Thanks for finding cats with me. I wonder what else is here. Come on. where all the cats are hanging out, relaxing like this one. Whoa, hi, I'm Mika. This room is so cool. There's a tree in here. Whoa, I bet the cats like to scratch on the tree. Maybe they scratch their back on there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Whoa, and cool thing is to climb on. 
Look, a little cat toy, a little mouse. <laughs> what else is over here? Whoa. Do you know what this is? This long yellow tube? The cats can climb up here and then climb through the tube. Maybe you've done something like that at a playground before. They must have so much fun here. And in each little cubby is where the cat can go and have a little nap. Any cats in here? Oh, there's a cat in there. I didn't even know that. Hi. Oh, there's two cats in there. I don't know if you can see. There's two cats just hanging out. Oh, a teddy bear. I wonder if cats like to cuddle with stuffed animals. That's so sweet. Aw. Well, I have a cat toy. Have you ever seen anything like this before? Let's see if some of these cats want to play with it, okay? Um, <laughs> anyone want to play with me today? What about you? <laughs> this cat's like, Please don't bother me, I'm trying to take a nap right now. Okay, understood, understood. Okay, hey look, there's big bowls of water here because it's important for cats to hydrate, just like us. Hey, something else that they can climb on. And look, these little holes, these little hidey holes that they can just get all comfy. Cats seem to nap a lot. <laughs> hey, Megan. Hey. Oh my goodness, who I is this? One more friend for you to see. This oh is Memphis. Oh my gosh, can I hold Memphis? Yes. Oh, look at this little kitten. How old is Memphis? He's eight weeks. Eight weeks? Just a little baby kitten. Wow, Memphis is brand new to the world. Oh, wait, is Memphis from Memphis? Um, I don't think so. I don't know how we got the name Memphis. Aww, it's a super cute name. So Memphis is only eight weeks old. What does Memphis usually do? Um, he plays with his two brothers. <gasps> you have two yeah, brothers? Yeah, two brothers. Oh, that's so fun. Wow, baby kittens are so teeny tiny. Aww, it's so nice meeting you, Memphis. Oh my goodness. You do such a good job taking care of all of these animals. Aw, thank you. Aw. <laughs> well, thanks for letting me hang out with you, Memphis. <laughs> that was so fun! Getting to hang out with dogs and cats today. We learned about how to take care of our pets and adopt them and make them part of our family. Oh, cats and dogs are so cool. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool! M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> well, thanks for learning with me. See you next time. Bye. Look at where I'm at. I'm at a super center. But look at what it is. It's a delicious apple. I wonder how this apple got here. Every apple at the grocery store came from an apple field. First, you gotta pick the perfect fruit. Like this one. This one looks really tasty. And after you pick it, you put it inside the bin with all the other apples. <laughs> Let's try and find an apple together. Hmm, do you see an apple? Ah, I see one. Yeah, look. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> It all starts by a worker handpicking every single apple. And then they dump their sack into the bins. And when the bin gets full, a tractor picks it up and takes it away. Now that the apples are all out of the fields and into the bins, 
and the bins are full, now we need to transport them to the trucks! Wow! Four giant bins full of apples! And one red tractor! Okay, the apples are now here at the semi-truck. Now we gotta load up all the bins on top of the back of the semi-truck with a forklift. are loaded on the back of the truck, so let's go! Off to the factory we go. We've arrived at the factory, so now we need to take a forklift and get every single bin off the back of the semi-truck. It is time to clean and package all of the apples! <laughs> Look! Green apples! Now we need to empty the bins of all of the apples so we can clean them and package them! The apples start their floating journey, while the bins get emptied out. Look, the bins are empty! Whoa! That's a lot of floating apples! Then they get taken out of the water and scrubby dub dub, <laughs> nice and clean! And clean some more! Look at all those bristles! Those apples look like they're having fun. <laughs> and then all the apples get sprayed with some water. Nice and clean. And then they go through giant fans. Once the apples are all dry, they get sorted. They get sorted by the ones that look really tasty to eat and ones <laughs> that don't look tasty to eat. And remember the not so tasty looking apples? Yeah, these are them. They get to go up some fun apple escalators and then they get to go down some radical apple conveyor belts on their journey to make some tasty apple pie. But we're not done there yet. Every tasty looking apple gets a sticker. This is the sticker machine. And once every single apple has its very own sticker, they get put on what I like to call apple beds. <laughs> Then the next step is that those apple beds get put inside of cardboard boxes. And some get put inside plastic bags. Oh, 
Looks like some of these boxes need their tops closed. Now that the apples are all clean and packaged up, we gotta store them in a giant refrigerator and wait for the trucks. We're inside the giant refrigerator now. It is very cold in here. This is where all of the apples get stored. Wow! Look at how many apples there are! That's a really tall storage building. Yippee! The semi truck is backing up to the building so it can be loaded up with a bunch of fresh apples. Alright, forklifts, just a little bit more apples. Now that the semi truck is all full of apples, it's gonna deliver them to the grocery stores. Ooh, it was sure fun seeing how apples get to the grocery store with you. And remember, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. Ring, 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 ring! Ring, ring! Hey! Look! We're on a farm! Look at all the animals! Whoa! Ooh! Ooh, look at this one! This is a cow! <laughs> and. A horse, ooh, and a pig. Oink, 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 oink. <laughs> ring, ring, ring. Okay, now that we're on a farm, let's see what other things we can find on the farm. Well, we saw animals already. Let's go. Ring, 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 ring. Whoa, bye bye. <laughs> we lost the wagon. We found some, we found a potato. We must be on a potato farm today. Potato. Ooh, and what are all these? A yellow hat. Okay, ooh, there we go. And, ooh, some eyeballs. <laughs> Gotta be able to see. Ooh, those are upside down. Okay, and, ooh, we have a red tongue. Oh, nope, that's the nose, actually. But we do have a red tongue. Put that right there. Ooh, it's starting to look like a potato head. And green feet or shoes. And pink ears. Uh, uh. Ah. <laughs> Ooh, are we missing something? Yeah. Ooh, look, down here. Two white arms. Put one right there. <laughs> and one right there. There. Whoa. Hello. <laughs> okay. You stay here, Mr. Potato Head. Let's go over here. Whoa. 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 Another Potato Head. Woo. <laughs> okay. Ooh. We got a blue hat this time. Oh, I'm Optimus Prime. I oh, know. No. Ooh. An arm with orange and blue goes on this side. Perfect. And another one. Ooh. 
Whoa! Whoa! Two eyes. One, two. Put them right there. Ooh, look at that orange nose. Put it right there. <laughs> and, ooh, look at the smile. <laughs> okay, let's put that right here. And last but not least, some green shoes. Or blue shoes. <laughs> I said they were green, but these are blue. <laughs> okay, see what else we can find. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Ooh, here's another one. Look, another potato head. Okay, we have some gray feet and a blue hat. Ooh, a police officer's hat, see? Wow. And whoa, a really big beard. Okay. And an orange nose again. Okay. There we go. Oh, what a cute nose. And ooh, a couple arms. Let's put those up like this. Whoa! <laughs> it fell out. Did you see that? Okay, let's put it right there. Hello! Okay. And, ooh, we forgot the ears. Oh, the ears are falling out. Let's see? Okay. And then, the eyes. Okay. <laughs> it keeps falling out. There we go. All right, now we're all finished. Hello! Hi! <laughs> okay. Here we go! Woohoo! Look at what it is! Whoa! It's a tractor and a backhoe! Whoa! Whoa! Look! It's a giant excavator! It's so big! Come on! Scoop up the dirt! And another potato head! Okay, here it is. Now, a blue construction hat for the excavator. Put that on top and a nose and an ear, and another ear, see, ooh, <laughs> and an arm, ah, and another white arm, okay, green shoes, ooh, put that right there, and two more things, we have a smile, Red smile. Eee. <laughs> Put that right there. And last but not least, a couple eyes. Okay, there we go. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's keep on moving. Look at all of these potato heads. I need to sit down for this one. Okay. Ooh, look at this. This one even has eyes on it already. Okay. Ooh. Huh. Nice little, nice little princess hat. Hello. <laughs> Let's find some more princess stuff. And, uh, ooh. Nice high heel shoes. Perfect. Put it right there. And we already have the eyes, so let's find a nose. Um, where's a nose? Here's a nose, a pink nose. Okay, put it right there. And we need a beautiful smile. Where is a beautiful smile? Let's see here. Huh, 
Ooh, here's a beautiful smile. Hee. Ooh. <laughs> okay. There she is. Nice and pretty. And ooh, a really big ear. Oh, that's too big, actually. A normal size ear. There we go. And another normal size ear. <laughs> We're almost done. We just need cute arms. Ooh, here's one. This is just the hand. That will look funny. Let's put it right there. See? Short little hand. Here's another one. High five. Boop. <laughs> okay. And there we go. There is our last potato head. Whoa, she's so pretty. <laughs> well, this was so much fun finding potato heads on the farm. If you want to watch more of my videos, you know what to do. Just ask a grown-up really nicely to search for my name. Do you know my name? Yeah, it's Blippi. Let's spell it together. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right. See you again. Wow, today we are at the Kids Club Indoor Playground in Las Vegas, Nevada. <laughs> hey, how are you? I'm going to be This is going to be fun. this place. Oh, this is going to be fun playing in here. But first things first, we need to take off our shoes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, here's one shoe. All right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And here's the second shoe. Whoa, did you see me balance? This is gonna be such a great time together. I am really excited to use my body and my muscles to have some fun. Come on. Whoa, look at these colorful steps. These are the color red. This step is the color green. And this step is the color yellow. Go over here. Watch out, there's a hole right here. Ooh, hello, hello. <laughs> Look at these punching bags. Let's use our arms and our arm muscles to punch them. Ready? Okay, let's do the red one first. And now the green one. Pop, 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 pop. <laughs> Ooh, there's another color. Come here. Whoa. All right. Looks like there's the color. Oh, <laughs> the punchy bag just hit you. Okay. One other color. Yeah, this color is yellow. Ooh. All right. Time to go this way. Whoa. Whoa! <laughs> I just went down this hole. Look! Peekaboo! Peekaboo! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> that was so much fun going down here. All right. Whoa! <gasps> Whoa! There's a yellow slide right here. Okay, I'm gonna go down the slide. You meet me at the bottom, okay? Whoa. Bye. <laughs> okay, here I come. One, two, three. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that slide was so fast. Okay, let's see what else there is. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! These are wiggle cars, and they're the color green, blue, 
yellow, pink, and red. Hmm, what one should we wiggle on today? How about the yellow one? All right, here we go. All right, let's wiggle away. Whoa. Look at this! This is a deflated bounce house. I think you and I should use our magic fingers to blow it up. Ready? Say magic fingers. Ready? Three, two, one. Magic fingers! Magic fingers! Now we get a bounce oh, oh, with our leg muscles inside. Come on. See, what I'm doing is I'm using my leg muscles to jump up and down. Whoa, whoa, look. It's kind of like I'm a frog. Ready? Ribbit, 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 ribbit! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! All right, here I come down the slide. Whoa! 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 That was funny! <laughs> Jeez, I am so exhausted from playing. Pretty important to drink lots of water when you're doing fun things like this. So let's drink some water. Woo! All right, now I'm ready for some more play. Come on. I'm gonna use my leg muscles to kick it. <laughs> that was awesome! Whoa! Now I'm gonna use my arm muscles to throw this. Yeah! All right. Woo! And what's this? <laughs> Hello! <laughs> okay, here I go. Now I'm gonna suck it in. Whoa! Did you see that? I just tightened up my abs, and then this thing slid down. Okay. Woo! Look at this. Whoa! Whoa. This is the color orange. This is the color red. <laughs> this is the color purple. Ooh. This is the color yellow. <laughs> Ooh. This is the color green. <laughs> and this is the color blue. <laughs> yeah! All right, watch out! Watch out! I'm trying to hit you! Whoa! Okay. Now you can hit me, ready? Okay. 
Here we go! Whoa! <laughs> Good job! You are so much fun! Whoa! Comfy, comfy sofas! Well, wait a second! It's not nap time, it's play time! <laughs> Come on! Whoa! Whoa! Look! Look at this giant yellow slide! I have a great idea. How about I go down the slide first, and then you go down the slide second! Alright? Okay, here I go! Are you ready? Here I go! Whoa! Wow! That was awesome! Alright, your turn! Hey! Alright! Come on! Yeah! Wow! Good job! Okay, here we go! Whoa! Look at this giant green slide I'm about to go down. All right, get ready. <laughs> Whoa! That was so much fun playing at this indoor playground. Well, if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Blippi! Yeah, let's spell it together. Ready? B-L-I P-P-I! Blippi! Good job! Now you know how to say and spell my name! See you again! Bye bye Today we are at the LBA Park in Olympia, Washington! Woo! Look at this! Whoa! This is the color blue! Woo! And that is yellow and black! Whoa! 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 This is the color red and a black stick. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, let me spin again. Ready? Whoa! 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 I'm really dizzy. Hey, speaking of spinning, whoa! Look at this! Wow, what is this? Looks kind of like a pyramid. Whoa. Whoa. This is the color yellow. Yeah, the ropes are yellow. And the base is the color blue. Watch, I'll spin it really fast. Okay, now I'll hop on. Whoa. <laughs> okay, let's go over here. at this. Wow. Jeez. I don't know what even to call this. Whoa. But I know what to do on it. You can climb on it. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. I'm really high in the air. Whoa. Whoa. Look. There's a little area down here. Look at these giant ropes. And then the small ropes right here. Wow, it's like I'm a monkey. <laughs> Whoa. <gasps> and swings, come on. You know what a swing is, right? Whoa. Whoa! Watch out! Whoa! Here I go! 
On the count of three, I'll launch off. One, two, here I go. Three, whoa. Okay. One, two, three, whoa. <laughs> whoa. One, two, three, whoa. Whoa. Oh, what's this? Come over here. Whoa. Okay, this looks like it's a, called a zip line. See, this is black, and you sit on it, and there's a really thick cable up top that then you can zip line down. Are you ready? Here we go. Get ready, go! Come on! Yeah! Whoa! 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 Whoa. That was so fun! Okay, we'll do it one more time. Okay. Okay. Alright. Here we go. Start going! Because I go fast! Okay! Whoa! 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 That was so much fun learning about colors with you. All right, bye bye. And I was just hanging out in this cardboard box. Check it out! It's like a bird! Whee! <laughs> oh, I have so many cardboard boxes around here. What are we to do with them? Hmm. I have an idea. Why don't we take a few of these cardboard boxes and make something out of them? <laughs> this is gonna be fun! Just making a rocket ship out of these cardboard boxes. <laughs> I am using these scissors nice and safely to cut a giant window out of it. Whoa, look at that! <laughs> wow. Ooh, now I can sit inside it later. <laughs> then we can explore outer space. I am so excited. Okay, here we go. So now that I have my window, I can then, put the cardboard box, well, used to be a box, now it's a rocket ship, up. And do you see this? This is a square. Yeah, but we actually need to make it a triangle. <laughs> so, let's take our scissors. Yep. With your parents' grown-up supervision, you can cut this nice and carefully. Okay, one side is done. And now we need to do the other side. Come on, here we go. <laughs> Look at that! It used to be a square, but now it's a triangle. <laughs> okay, now we need some tape to then tape it to make the top of the rocket ship. Okay, here we go. Let's grab the tape, pull off a big piece of tape. Whoa! Alright, let's give it a little slice. Okay, there we go. Whoa! <laughs> okay, put that there. I love making things out of cardboard boxes. You can make so many things. Today we're making a rocket ship, but one time I made a monster truck, another time I made a dolphin, <laughs> and I named that dolphin, uh, what was that name? I think it was Dolphy. <laughs> oh, oh, sometimes the tape gets stuck, but that's okay, we got it. Alright, there we go, give it a little slice. 
then tape up the other side. Wow, here we go. I am so excited to go into outer space. Have you ever seen the stars at night? Yeah, they're so bright. <laughs> and the moon? I love the moon. Have you noticed that the moon sometimes is a full moon? Yeah, sometimes it's a half moon, and sometimes it's a new moon. <laughs> yeah, okay, let's uh, give this a little twist. Now it's time to design our rocket ship. I am so excited. This is one of my favorite parts. So, the first step to design is to have a plan. So let's take this white piece of paper right here and let's draw the rocket ship. So the first thing you need to do is plan. Plan how the rocket ship is going to look. So let's draw the rocket ship. So we have a trapezoid over here and then we have a big rectangle for the body of the rocket ship and then we have a triangle for the cone of the rocket ship. And obviously, I want a lot of color. So first, let's take some orange. Perfect. I love orange. And then let's take some blue. So, let's color it in. I have a plan. I'm going to use colored paper for that. So I'm actually going to use this black marker to symbolize that these are pieces of paper. We will do that later. All right. Oh, whoa, there's a lot of stars here. So let's actually, you know, make some stars right here. Yeah. Yeah, I love stars because you see them at nighttime when you look up in the sky and they twinkle. Yeah, kind of like twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. <laughs> you know that song. I like that song too. Oh, and yellow. That's a beautiful color. Wow, our rocket ship is looking so good. All right, I think I have a really good idea. Let's take the color red, because it's nice and bright, and spell my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B L I P P Flippy! Perfect! Alright, so that is the plan. Huh, oh, looks like this triangle, the top of the rocket ship. Yeah, we could color it. How about we color it, yeah, blue. I like blue! And we actually have a lot of blue paint on the here, so we can actually just use blue paint for this part. Wow, perfect! Wow, I think if we can make this rocket ship in real life, it's gonna be so good. All right, here we go. All right, like I said, first thing we have to do is use the blue and orange colored paper to put on the side, just like this. So let's take the glue stick. Yeah, yep, put a lot of glue right on the backs, just like that, okay. There's two pieces. Okay, there's one. And here's the second piece. All right, there's one, two pieces of paper. And we got to do two more. Yeah, which will make one, two, three, four pieces of paper. I'm gonna put the glue on them right over here. Okay, now we have four pieces. One, two, three, four. So let me finish the rest and then we'll see how many we have in total after I'm all done, all right? Whoa! Look! <laughs> it's falling apart. <laughs> well, sometimes 
if things fall apart, we just have to fix them. Okay, here we go. And after we fix this, then we can count all of the colors. So, let's take our tape. All right, now the rocket booster is all fixed. Yep, there we go. Okay, now let's count all of the colored pieces. Yeah, the blue and the orange pieces. Those are my two favorite colors. Okay, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight pieces of paper. <laughs> Good job. Okay, what else did we have on our piece of paper over here of our initial plans of our rocket ship to go to outer space? We had stars. Yeah, remember? We had yellow stars. Yellow star. yellow star. Wow. They're so bright and they twinkle just like the real thing. <laughs> okay, and let's put some blue stars on there. Can you think of anything that's the color blue? <laughs> My shirt. What about the big vast blue ocean. <laughs> yeah. Here's another blue star. There we go. What about a purple star? Yeah. I like the color purple. Put it right there. And last but not least, another purple star. Right there. Perfect. That looks so cool. <laughs> All right, so as you remember, we have to spell my name on it because that's what was on the plans. But before we do that, let's do the top of the rocket ship. Remember what color I said I was going to paint it? Yeah, the color blue. Okay, let's take some blue paint and <laughs> my painter's palette. I'm an artist. <laughs> and let's take a paintbrush. Ooh, I love painting. <laughs> okay, and let's squeeze some blue paint right on top. Whoa! 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 <laughs> That's so much fun. Okay, let's give it a little dab. Let's do some painting. There we go. Wow. This is such a pretty blue. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, there we go. Have you ever used paints before? They're so fun. You can use a paintbrush and you can even use your fingers sometimes. We won't do that today, but that Art technique is called finger painting. <laughs> there we go. How does that look? Do you like that? Yeah, I do too. Okay, let's put this away. We need to stay nice and clean and organized. There we go. And remember the last thing we needed to do? We needed to spell someone's name. Oh yeah, my name, Blippi. Will you spell it with me? B L I. P-P-I! Flippy, good job! And do you remember what color? Yeah, the color red. Okay, so let's use a new paintbrush. Yep. And then we need to make sure we don't mix the red and the blue because then it won't be red anymore and it won't be blue. Do you know what color you get when you mix blue and red? Yep, purple! But we're gonna keep them separate. <laughs> so, 
Let's take this cap off. Oh, there is so much paint in here. And I like to use a lot of paint. Whoa! There we go. Whee! Wow, a little bit more. All right, there we go. Okay, let's, uh, before we paint it, we should probably lay it down sideways because we need to write my name, which is sideways. Yeah, there we go, like that. That's how we write sideways. Okay, let's take our paintbrush and let's put the letter B right here. Now that we have the letter B, the second letter is the letter L. Yeah, just like that. The third letter is an I. Ready? Okay, there we go. B L I. <laughs> you know the next letter. A P, yeah. B L I P. B L I P P. Yeah, here we go. Alright, one last letter. B L I P P I. Blippy, good job. <laughs> there we go. We just completed the rocket ship. So now we gotta get inside. Oh no! Do you see what I did? <laughs> We're so silly! <laughs> Check this out. The window is right there. Yeah! That means we have to twist it this way. See? And now, my name is upside down! <laughs> That's okay though. We're gonna fly through outer space in this new cardboard rocket ship. I am so excited. What? My name being upside down. <laughs> so silly. Are you ready? <laughs> because I sure am. Here we go! building the rocket ship with me. Now that we're in outer space, I think we should explore our solar system and learn all about it. All right, here we go. Whoa! 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 Look at that. That is our sun, and its name is called the sun. <laughs> How original. Our sun provides all the light in our solar system. And that light takes eight minutes to go from the sun to our planet Earth. And the sun is so big, there's 1.3 million Earths that can fit inside of it. Whoa! That's a lot of Earths. Here we go. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Outer space is so much fun. Oh, look at that planet. That planet is Mercury. Wow, that planet is really rocky. And it, there's so many craters on it. And actually, since it's the closest planet to the sun, one rotation around the sun is super fast. It's only about 88 days on Earth. <laughs> Mercury is awesome. Look at that planet! That planet is the planet Venus. And it is so hot! It's the hottest planet! Woo! It's getting hot in here! <laughs> the planet has so many volcanoes on it! And it's actually really bright. If you look up in the sky from our planet Earth, you can actually see it without a telescope! Wow! <laughs> here we go! Whoa! Where you and I live. Wow, 
Oh, what a beautiful planet. There's so much water there, and then there's a lot of trees and mountains. Whoa, and our planet Earth? Yeah, we have one moon. Let's head there now. sent robots and rovers to Mars. That is awesome. Us humans have yet to land on Mars ourselves, but maybe someday soon, maybe you'll be the astronaut. Yeah, here we go. That's our planet Jupiter. It's the biggest planet in our solar system. And do you see that big red dot? That is a storm. Whoa, that's a big storm. And Jupiter actually has 79 moons. <gasps> that's crazy. Whoa! <laughs> Is our planet Saturn. Whoa, what are those? Those are Saturn's rings. Wow, there's so much dust, ice, and rocks that form those to make up those rings. Wow, what a cool looking planet. All right, Saturn, see you later. Bye bye. Uranus. Yeah, what a cool planet. Wow, it's kind of blue looking, huh? Yeah, that's because there's so much ice on it. It's known as the big ice planet. Whoa, it has 13 rings and 27 moons. All right, see you later, Uranus. Bye bye. Whoa. That planet is the planet Neptune. It's so dark, cold, and windy on that planet. Oh, let's get out of here. The last planet of our solar system. Look at it, it's really small. That is Pluto. It's so small, it's a dwarf planet. Wow, and it's really cold. I love Pluto. <laughs> it's really chilly out here, though. Let's turn around and count all of the planets, shall we? System together. Hey, I think we should count all of them. Okay, the sun isn't a planet, so let's count the planets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, oh w w wait a second. Eight, nine? Ah, uh, who knows? <laughs> Some people say Pluto's not a planet, but. I don't know, it's all up in the air right now, well, or outer space. <laughs> so silly. Eight or nine, we'll keep it at that. Okay, now let's name the planets. Ready? Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, Pluto. Wow, good job. All right. Well, I should probably get going now. Maybe we'll go and explore another solar system someday. All right, see you later. Bye-bye. Well, hello, it's me, Blippi, and today we're at Amy.
Amy's Playground in South Pasadena, California. Come on! Whoa! Hey, who are you? I'm Brian the Illusionist. Ooh, that's cool. What are you doing? I'm building a rainbow. Ooh, a rainbow? <laughs> First thing we need is a white cloud. Okay. A blue. I don't know what you call it, maybe arch. Yeah. A green good. one. Okay. Blue. Green. green. Yellow. Okay, yellow. Just like the color of the sun. Orange. Ooh, orange. One of my two favorite colors. See? <laughs> red. Ooh, red. <laughs> I love the color red too. And then we need clear. Oh, for this extra special move right here. Oh, what's he gonna do? I don't know. <laughs> I'm so excited. We'll find out, won't we? Yep. Whoa. Wow, I love learning my colors. <laughs> this is the hard part. Okay, here we go. Looks almost like it's complete. And there we have a rainbow. Oh, look at that. <laughs> So cool! Whoa! Hey! Woohoo! Well, thank you so much! Rainbows are fun! How many colors does this rainbow have? Let's see. Red, orange, yellow, green, and blue! So colorful! Colorful rainbow! So colorful! Colorful rainbow! So colorful! balloon dog. <gasps> a dog? I love dogs! All right, start from here. Okay. Create sort of a U shape. Okay. And then tightly squeeze. The tighter you squeeze, the easier it is to twist. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> okay. Now, we are gonna create another U shape. All right. <laughs> tightly squeeze, leaving a bubble for a neck. Okay. This is fun! And then we're gonna fold the tail towards the neck, create another U shape, and tightly squeeze. All right, I'm doing it. <laughs> now, if you thought that was cool, why don't you place it on the table? Okay, <laughs> awesome. Whoa, look at it. That's my dog, Lino. Hey, Lino. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> if you think that was cool, what? Just a balloon, but with a little imagination, we can create a dinosaur. A dinosaur? I love dinosaurs. I wonder what one my favorite dinosaur is. <laughs> so silly. Cool. Look at him, just twisting it. Whoa. Do you know what color that is? Yeah, a green dinosaur. <laughs> Whoa. <gasps> Whoa! There you are! Whoa! It's a T-Rex! <laughs> now, if you thought that was cool, place it on the table. <gasps> okay! <laughs> Whoa! Oh, look! A bigger T-Rex! <laughs> <laughs> that is so cool! Now, if you thought that was cool, check this out! Whoa! <laughs> Let's act like T-Rexes together. Ready? <laughs> that was so cool. Thank you so much. Whoa! What a scary T-Rex. Let's dance to this dino song. Today, 
I'm making a parrot. Making a parrot? Boo, boo. <laughs> yeah, a parrot is a bird. I love birds. They just fly in the sky. Boo. Go. Go. <laughs> and this parrot is the color white. <laughs> that is so cool. Whoa! Whoa! Look! It's a parrot in its cage! Caca! That's so cool! Now, if you thought that was cool, place it on the table! <gasps> okay! Whoa! Look! It's even a bigger parrot now! Go, go! Go, go! Will you act like a bird? Of course! Go, go! Go, go! Oh, you want a cracker? <laughs> Wow, this is so cool. Well, if you thought that was cool, round two. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, look. It's a bird. Go, 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 go. See you later. Go, go. There are so many types of birds. They are so cool. They fly. And do you know what? They also sing. Yeah, they sound like this. What are you doing? Well, I was trying to make you out of balloons, but you couldn't stand still long enough for me to make it. Aw, that's silly. Well, what was I doing? Jumping jacks. Jumping jacks? Really? Will you do some jumping jacks with me? Ready? Here we go! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, look at me go! Hey, good job! <laughs> Keep it up! Oh, I'm getting tired! <laughs> playing at Amy's Playground in South Pasadena, California. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. Good job. Bye-bye. Oh, hey, it's me, Blippi, and look at where I'm at. Yeah, I am at Valley Auto in Tenino, Washington. This is where they work on vehicles. Whoa, do you see that truck up there? Whoa, it's so high up there, that's crazy. Whoa, 
So many cool machines in here. Come on. Whoa. Look at this big truck. Do you see how it's on the ground? Yeah, they're on the ground, but then they use these big things called lifts to go underneath and lift it up to the sky. So then the mechanics can work underneath the truck and car, so then they don't have to bend down or be uncomfortable. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at this. Whoa, this is so heavy. Wow, this is a battery. Yeah, most vehicles have batteries, so then it helps them turn on. Yeah, land also, turn on the radio. <laughs> and things like that. Yeah, batteries have electricity stored inside. Ooh, look at these. These are hose clamps. Whoa, there's a small one. And here is a big one. These are what goes around hoses and clamps them nice and tight. Hey. What shape are these? Yeah, these are circles. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? All right, let's put those back. Let's keep exploring. Whoa, look at all of these. Do you see these? Wow, this right here, yeah, is a nut, washer, and a bolt. This is what you use to tighten things. Yeah, nice and close together. Like say if there is a piece of metal right here and another piece of metal, you could tighten it nice and tight so then it doesn't slip and slide. <laughs> All right, let's put that back. Uh, <laughs> okay, woo, so cool. Whoa, this is a massive engine. That looks so powerful. Wow, so cool. Well, hey, let's see. Oh, look at this. Remember earlier how I said that the lift lifts up the truck so the mechanic can stand up nice and tall? Well, sometimes you might not have a lift and you need to get really low on the ground and work on the vehicle from the ground. Whoa, hey, whoa. Whee! <laughs> Look at me go! I'm a mechanic! Whee! <laughs> yeah, you can slide because it has wheels. <laughs> okay, all right, enough playing around. Let's get to work. Oh, hey, it's someone else. Who are you? Colton. Oh, nice to meet you, Colton. Well, what are you doing over there? Uh, getting ready to weld. Oh, weld? That's really cool. Hey, do you know what welding is? Yeah, welding's where you take two pieces of metal and apply some electricity, heat, some gas, and it becomes so hot, they come, become connected. Yeah, it's kind of like glue, but for metal. <laughs> well, Colt, will you show us how to do it? Yep, I just need to lift up the truck. All right, let's check it out. <laughs> Oh, do you see what they're doing? Yeah, there's, they're using those metal posts to go under the truck, so then they can work underneath it safely so it doesn't fall on them. Okay, let's watch them weld. Here, check it out. <laughs> See these? Yeah, these are his gloves. It keeps his hands protected while he's welding. And this looks like his helmet. Yeah, and it has this really dark shade right here. So then he can look at what he's doing because it's too bright to look at without this. You definitely never want to look at what you're doing welding unless you have this. 
So if you ever see someone welding, do not look at that light, okay? Okay. Oh, here you go. <laughs> Colton did such a great job welding. Hey, Colton, thank you so much for showing us how to weld. Yep, no problem. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's keep exploring. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa. This has been so much fun. Did you see when he was welding? It looked like fireworks. Whoa. Yeah, that was awesome. Ooh. Look at this yellow toolbox. Whoa, I think we should open it up and see what tools are inside. Whoa! Whoa! Look at these socket sets. Wow! That is so nicely organized. Whoa! Remember earlier? Yeah, we were talking about those nuts. Yeah, these sockets go over the nuts. And then you use a lever to then turn it. And then you can get it nice and tight. Yeah, that is really cool. Ooh, let's see what else is in here. I love tools. They're so much fun. Whoa, look. Yeah, a wrench. Yeah, you can also use these to tighten nuts. <laughs> that is so cool. All right, let's put it away. Ooh, what else is in here? Whoa, yeah, a crescent wrench. Whoa. We must have a customer. Someone else will get that. But hey, check it out, a crescent wrench. Looks like a mount. Hello? Hello? <laughs> That's silly. Okay, well, oh, look at this. You know what this is? Yeah, it kind of looks like a hammer, doesn't it? Yeah, but it's actually a rubber mallet. Watch this. Yeah! You can hit things with it. Yeah! You, uh, like a tire. Watch this! <laughs> I don't know what you would do that for, but it's fun! Whoa! Yeah! A vice right here? Yeah, you can put things in here. Turn this and see it closing? Yeah! keeps things held right here, so then you can work on it. Woohoohoo, look! Yeah, looks like a fan. It looks like a fan, yeah! This looks like a fan that goes in front of the radiator. Wow, I sure do love mechanic shops and tools. Hey, I think this is the perfect time for the tool song, yeah! When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things When you're working with tools Working with tools You hear all kinds of things The wrench tightens pipes going clang clang A hammer hits a nail going bang 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 A drill is making holes going zzz When you're working with tools you hear all kinds of things When you're working with tools Working with tools you hear all kinds of things When you're working with tools Working with tools You hear all kinds of things You hear thuds and squeaks Cracks and rings When you're working with tools You hear all kinds of things You hear bangs and booms Clangs and zings When you're working with tools You hear all kinds of things Cutting wires with some pliers Going snip snip Cutting paper with some scissors going clip clip When you're working with tools you've got to be real safe By wearing gloves on your hands and goggles on your face And boys and girls when you're working with tools 
always follow mom and dad's safety rules. When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. When you're working with tools, working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. You hear thuds and squeaks, cracks and rings. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. You hear bangs and booms, clangs and zings. When you're working with tools, you hear all kinds of things. Check it out! Yeah, it looks like we have some big bolts. Whoa! And we have some big nuts. Whoa! Hey, what's this doing here? Do you know what this is? Yeah, it's a steering wheel. Ten and two. <laughs> Driving a car is so much fun. You'll get there. And you need to very safe and always wear your seat belt. But hey, in order to drive your car, you need to maintain your vehicle. Yeah, and that is why we're at the mechanic shop. <laughs> but hey, check these out. Whoa, this is the cylinder head. Whoa, there's so many parts to an engine, and this is just one of them. Whoa, and over here, this is the exhaust manifold. Whoa. Yeah, like I said, there's a lot of parts to an engine, but this is where the engine is, and then the exhaust goes through all these pipes to the back of the vehicle. Yeah, and you've probably seen exhaust pipes before. Yeah. Well, hey, I have one last thing to show you right over here. The best part about mechanic shops is cleaning up at the end of the day, and all your hard work pays off. <laughs> Well, this has been so much fun learning about tools with you today and welding and what it's like to be in a shop. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. All right. See you again. Bye-bye. <laughs> Whee. <laughs> I love penguins! <laughs> Flipping and flapping, we all love penguins. Water or land, swimming or waddling, black and white. The cutest little pals, flipping and flapping. We all love penguins! Whoa! <laughs> Look at them all! They're so cute and cuddly! And they're really hungry! <laughs> Whoa! Look how soft they are! Hey! Hello! Those are my suspenders! <laughs> Tiny little feathers Preening with their beaks Wings like flippers Helps them in the sea When they're in the water They move easily But when they're on the land They look so clumsy! Flipping and flapping We all love penguins Water or land Swimming or waddling Black and white The cutest little pals Flipping and flapping There's many different types Some live on the rocky coast Some live on the ice Now it's time to feed them They're looking hungry Silver sides and sardines Their favorite fish to eat Flipping and flapping We all love penguins Water or land Swimming or waddling Black and white The cutest little pals Flipping and flapping We all love penguins Have you ever actually like a penguin before? <laughs> I'll show you how. First, let's imagine we live in Antarctica. Then, put your arms straight by your side and waddle around. <laughs> wow! Great job being a penguin with me.
exercise and see insights So many great things about bikes So many sights to see on the bicycle We can travel free Look at all the scenery Feel the forest air Today, we're at the Discovery Children's Museum in Las Vegas, Nevada. Let's go! This is gonna be so much fun! Hello there, have a good time, Blippi. Thank you! <laughs> Come on! Whoa! Check this place out. This is Water World. Let's go have some fun with water. Whoa, look at this. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> a lot of water spraying up in the air. Let's take this red ball, put it right here. Whoa. Whoa. Take some more of these balls and do that again. Okay, this time let's pick from the red, yellow, or the green ball. Let's do the green ball this time. Here we go! Bye-bye! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> it didn't work. Let's try the green ball again. Now, let's do the yellow ball. Whoa! There it goes! Whoa! Huh. Whoa! <laughs> that was awesome! Do you hear that? Oh, these little water squirters are squirting these metal pieces. And these metal pieces are hitting each other and they're making noise. Listen. Wow, that's some beautiful music. <laughs> oh, what's this over here? Do you see these two things spinning? Wow, yeah, that one's going counterclockwise mm -hmm. and this one is going clockwise. But hey, check this out. See, if you take it out of the water, it's not spinning anymore because it's balanced on both sides. But if we put the water right here, just a little bit, it fills up with water like that. And then it gets heavy on this side. And that is when it starts to spin. Wow. Whoa, what's that way over there? Whoa, kind of looks like a tornado. Spinning around and around really fast. I have an idea. 
Let's take some balls and put it through the top and see what happens. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> there we go! Okay, I'll do two green balls at once. Whoa! That is awesome. Let's go learn about some more things at this children's museum. Let's go. Whoa, check out this place. This is Fantasy Festival. Ooh, there's a cool thing like this, which is a treasure map. And there's a pirate ship back there, a stage. This place is awesome. But first, let's find where the treasure is. Let's look at the treasure map. So these are pieces of land. Oh, wow. That's awesome. Two big islands. Actually, there we go. Let's make three islands. One, two, three. And then we have a volcano on an island. And oh, another volcano. Okay, we need a pirate ship right over here. Hmm. Go around this big island, go around the small volcano, and that island, that volcano, and then we'll arrive to the treasure. <laughs> okay, in order to find the treasure, we need to dress up like a pirate. Ah! I got my pirate hat on. Perfect. And my sword. Now to the stage. Can you see I've got Arr. 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 Really Arr. <laughs> oh, that's silly. Woo! Check this out. Whoa. The pirate ship is docked. And do you see this? That is a starfish. Hey. Have you ever wondered why a starfish is called a starfish? Yeah, it looks like a star, but it doesn't look like a fish. <laughs> That's silly. It doesn't have gills or scales, and it can't even swim. But it does have these things on the bottom. Oh, they tickle. <laughs> They're kind of like little feet and suction cups, kind of, that go boom. Look at this! Whoa! These are the cannons! Whoa! Did you see that? These cannons help the pirate ship to defend themselves from other pirates! Alright! Fire in the hole! Yeah! Let's go do some cannons ourselves! Let's go, matey! My shoulders where he stands. Arr. And I wear some earrings, which adds to my pizzazz. Look as good, Captain. My ship is... Okay, we're at the lower deck. And here are the powerful cannons. Wow. Okay, first we need to get a cannonball. See? See? One cannonball. Load it in! Okay. There we go. Here we go. Fire in the hole. Yeah. Let's do another one. Okay. Load it up. Fire in the hole. <laughs> yeah. That was awesome. Okay. Now let's head to the top of the pirate ship. Wow. It's really dark down there at the bottom of the deck. Okay, let's go up to the top. Wow, this is awesome. Hey, look at this. This is a way to get supplies down to the bottom or over to the land. All right, I'm lowering it down. Perfect. Okay, now they'll put some stuff in it, and then I'll bring it up. I wonder what's inside. 
We'll save that for later. Oh, check it out. This is the crow's nest. Wow. That's where you stand, up in there. So then you get a good bird's eye view from afar. And on the crow's nest, a lot of the times, you fly a flag. So let's put a flag on right here. And this is the Union Jack flag. Up we go, mateys! Yeah! Whoa! It's so windy! <laughs> oh, let's go up a little bit more to the top deck. Check it out! The steering wheel of the pirate ship. Kind of like a steering wheel in a vehicle. Ring, ring, whoa, whoa! Hey look, a compass! Wow, do you see that arrow? It points to the direction that we're going. Huh, interesting. N, E, S, W. North, east, south, west. Huh, those are the main directions. It's kind of tricky to remember. You know how I remembered it? I remembered it as never eat soggy waffles. <laughs> That's silly. Or you can make up your own. Like, never ever stop wandering. Yeah, always keep exploring, kids. <laughs> Let's go. <gasps> Whoa, look. <gasps> yeah, the treasure chest. We found the treasure. Good job, matey! Arr! Yes! Yes, matey! Arr! Hey, hey! Come on in! This is Toddler Town. Welcome! This area is for five years and under. And you can have a lot of fun, like this area. This is the crawl zone. This is where you take off your shoes, and you can learn to crawl. Whoa, see these ridges right here? Oh, there's so many things to touch. Yeah, all the good sensory things. Whoa, look. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, interesting. So many interesting things in this area. Looks like bells in a cylinder that's clear. Whoa. I'm gonna go down here. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Wait, what's that? Wow. Hmm. I like to feel things. They feel different. This kind of feels like carpet. Whoa, and this is really hard. And it's shiny. Whoa, and what's this? Wow, it's kind of like mesh. Yeah, metal mesh. Oh, what's this? Huh. It's kind of like wood. Brown painted wood. <laughs> okay, let's continue. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Wow, look at this over here. Whoa, looks like a beautiful picture. Kind of looks like Nevada. <laughs> okay, let's take the animals and guess where they go. Hmm, where does the fish go? <gasps> yeah, the fish goes in the water. Okay, ooh, a rattlesnake. Oh, <gasps> where does the rattlesnake go? Oh yeah, right here in the desert area where it's dry and really hot. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see. Ooh, looks like a, a ram. <laughs> Big horned sheep. Where does it go? Yeah, way up here. Oh, on the top of the rock. So then it can look for anything and everything. 
to keep eyes out for predators. Yep, there you go. Oh hey, check it out. This is a tortoise. Wow, <laughs> the shells of tortoises are really hard. Um, it goes right there. Ooh, a jackrabbit. Where does the jackrabbit go? Yeah, see these little bushes? Yeah, it likes to hide around them for cover. There you go. Really smart. Ooh, a toad. Interesting. Rubba, 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 rubba. <laughs> yeah, it goes right here, next to the water and the land. So then, it can get some nice water. <laughs> yum, 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 I love water. Okay, whoa! What is this? <laughs> this is a giant dragonfly. <laughs> Let's put it way up there, because it's flying in the sky. Ooh, an owl goes in the tree, and then the bird goes on the branch. Good job. <gasps> okay, let's keep moving. Ooh, this area is called the touch and feel. <gasps> okay, let's do the first one. You have to guess what it is. What does it feel like? Whoa. Yeah, it's kind of scaly, but not scaly. <gasps> yeah, it's a rattlesnake. Ooh, do you feel this? This is really soft. I like to feel things. Oh, yeah, it's soft. That's the jackrabbit. Ooh, and what's this? Kind of feels like wool. It's soft, but also very firm. Huh? That's the sheep. Whoa, and this is hard. Yeah, I bet you know what that is. Yeah, a tortoise. <laughs> okay, let's hear what these animals sound like. Okay, I'll push this button, then you have to guess what it sounds like. Ready? <laughs> yeah, that's the toad. Let's do this next one. <laughs> yep, the great horned Owl. Hey, guess this one. Do you know what animal that is? <laughs> yeah, that's the jackrabbit. What animal is this? Yeah, the mountain bluebird. Let's act like birds together. <laughs> okay, let's do this next one. Ready? Oh, it's kind of scary sounding. Oh. Yeah, if you hear that, you have to be very careful. That is a rattlesnake. Okay, last one, ready? You know what this is. Yeah, I knew that, I promise. That was the sheep. Bah. so much fun learning about those animals. Ooh, check out this place. You can color with crayons or markers. Ah, that looks like fun. Ooh, weird. This is a spiral. Pretty nifty. Yep, a spiral goes around and around in a circle. Gets bigger or smaller, depending on what direction. Whoa, that's interesting shape. Goes up, 90 degree turn, 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 90 degree turn. Oh, a zigzag. Whoa, 
and a curvy line. Kind of looks like a snake. Yeah, do you hear that? Yeah, like a rattlesnake. Ooh, another sensory area. Oh, so this bucket gets changed out every single week. So the time that I was here, it's this. It has really soft feathers. Wow. And it has, interesting, these foam pieces that are different shapes. Interesting. And different colors. And it feels so good. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> This is the children's hospital. Come on in. Whoa. This is where all the doctors and nurses work. And there's a lot of babies. But first, we need to scan our body. Step right up here. So then the x-ray can scan us. And what it's doing, oh, you have to stand still. What it's doing is scanning my body for if there's any broken bones. Scan complete. <laughs> okay, let's see the findings. Whoa. All right, let's put on this white area and it illuminates from the back. Wow, look, that's my spine. And my hip bones right there. Wow, that's really cool. Here we go. Let's check my hand out. Let's inspect it. Hmm. Yep, that's my hand. Okay, is there any broken bones? Nope, I think I'm good. <laughs> okay, ah, let's keep that up. <gasps> oh, shh, the babies are sleeping. Hi. Oh, they're so cute. Hello. Oh. Okay, let's see. This is the patient chart, and this is Damon Washington, African American, male, seven months old, 18 pounds, oh, and he has a cough. Okay, all right. Hey Damon, how are you buddy? How are you? This is Damon, hey Damon. Okay, let's give Damon a checkup. Okay, we'll be right back Damon. Hey. Okay. First, we need to get this table nice and comfy for Damon. Put this on right here. Okay, Damon, here we go. Hey, Damon. Okay, how are you? Okay, let's put Damon on this comfy pad right here. Perfect. Hey, Damon, it's gonna be a little chilly. I have to take off this blanket. So, we can then, Use this stethoscope on Damon, come on. A stethoscope is used to check the heartbeat. Ready? Here you go, Damon. Here you go. Do you hear that? Good, good job. Take a deep breath. Ah. Your heart is nice and healthy, Damon. <laughs> okay. All right, what else do we have? Ooh, a thermometer. This will help tell the temperature of Damon. So, let's stick this thermometer in Damon's mouth. Okay, stay still. Oh, great, 98.6 degrees. You're nice and healthy, Damon. <laughs> okay, ooh. We have a comb. <laughs> Let's go brush his hair. <laughs> oh, so handsome. There you go, buddy. <laughs> there you go. Great. Perfect. Okay, let's see what else there is. And, oh, a bottle. I bet Damon's really hungry. Woo. <laughs> All right, Damon. Here you go. Eat up. How does that taste? Yum! <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. 
That was so much fun taking care of the babies and getting our expert x-ray in the doctor's office. <laughs>、Oh, hey. I love smoothies. Have you ever had a smoothie before? Yeah, they're so tasty and cold. <laughs> so refreshing. <gasps> Perfect! Eco Cafe! Let's go make a smoothie. Wow, so we have some blenders and some fruit over here. Wow, this is gonna be so much fun. Okay, first things first. We need to put this around us so we don't get dirty. So, tie that in the back. Okay, let's grab this green plate and put some fruits and vegetables on it. Okay, how about two red strawberries? Yum. <laughs> let's do one yellow lemon. Yum. And let's do. Two green apples. Perfect. Doesn't that look tasty? <laughs> yeah. Okay, now let's blend them all up. <gasps> Yum. <laughs> okay. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh, that's silly. They fell on the ground. Okay, let's put them in the blender. One apple in the blender. And. Let's do a strawberry in the blender. Okay, let's blend it up. <laughs> Perfect! Alright, now it's all blended up. I need to grab a cup. Okay, here we go. Let's pour it in the cup. Mmm, yum! Okay, here's one cup full of some smoothie. Now, let's make some juice. Let's come over to this juicer. Whoa! <laughs> And then, let's put them right in there the yellow lemon, the green apple, and the red strawberry. Put the lid on. And here we go! Alright, there we go! Yum! Mmm, so healthy and tasty! Good job! All this playing and learning is making me hungry! Let's go shopping! Grab one of these baskets! Whoa! Look at this place! This is a grocery store! And the goal today is to find some nice, healthy food. So let's see here. Oh, hey, look! <laughs> wow! A potato! A potato is a vegetable. Is that healthy or not healthy? Yeah! A potato, vegetables are healthy! Let's put it in the basket. Let's see, what else do we have? Ooh, some broccoli. Yeah, broccoli is a vegetable. Vegetables are healthy. Ooh, an orange. Oranges are the color orange. <laughs> and oranges are fruit. And fruit are healthy. Let's put it right there. Okay. Ooh, a pear. Another fruit. That is healthy. All right, let's see what else we can find. Hello! <laughs> okay, what's in this aisle? Okay, so we have some vanilla frosting, and we have, ooh, right up here, we have some bran flakes. What one of these is healthy? 
bran flakes are healthy. Let's put the bran flakes in there, and let's put the vanilla frosting back. Okay, let's try another one. Let's see, oh, we have some oats for oatmeal, and we have, oh, some cola. Is cola soda pop healthy? No, we'll put that back. Is oatmeal healthy? Yeah, oatmeal is healthy. Let's put that in our basket. Good job. Oh, okay. We have some more items to pick. Okay, let's see. We have milk. Oh, and we have whipped cream. Which one of these is healthy? Yeah, milk. <laughs> That's pretty healthy. Whipped cream, lots of sugar. Not so healthy. Let's put that back and uh, let's move on. Oh, another aisle. Ooh, yum. <laughs> okay, we have some rice and we have some brownies. Which one is healthy? Yeah. Rice is healthy. Let's put that in our basket. And for the brownies, hmm, not too healthy. I really do like brownies, but we need to get some healthy things. So good job with all this healthy shopping. So for doing such a really good job, I think you and I should get a treat. Whoa, look. Cupcakes, I love cupcakes. Ah. Oh, and what's down here? Hello. Ooh, and donuts. So, for doing such good job shopping healthy, let's pick a cupcake or a donut. Hmm, I have an idea. How about we both get one? Let's take a cupcake and a donut. <laughs> Let's put them right there. <laughs> we'll save those for later. Good job. Okay, here we go. Let's check out. We need to purchase all these items. Okay, there we go. All right. <laughs> okay, we need to scan them and then purchase them. Wow. That was so much fun going shopping with you. Wow. <laughs> I love shopping for healthy things. <laughs>
now let's check the engine compartment. Okay, okay, the cylinder's working really good. The battery looks awesome. Oh, this air filter looks like it could be clean. Let me go right over here. Okay, knock it out. Go. Oh. Okay, nice and clean. Let's put it back right there. Okay, now we need to do the fluids. The oil, the coolant, the antifreeze, and the wiper fluid, right over here. First, let's start with the oil. Okay, undo the cap, part right there. <laughs> Perfect, all right, and then, Let's do that antifreeze and coolant. And what this does is make sure that the vehicle does not freeze during winter and it stays cold during summer. Put it right there. Perfect. Okay. And then this is the windshield wiper fluid. And this is what sprays on your windshield and cleans off the windshield so you can see. Let's put it right there. Ah, perfect. And the brake fluid looks good and the power steering fluid looks good. Wow, this vehicle is running so efficiently. Good job. Whoa. This area is called Young at Art. Oh, let's make some art. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. This is a round cylinder chalkboard. I have an idea. Let's take some chalk. Whoa, <laughs> that's awesome. Let's take some more chalk. Here we go. Wow, <laughs> that was so much fun. What else is around here? Ooh, a microscope. Wow, check this out. Whoa, do you see these? These are different types of materials. Like we have cardboard, paint. Ooh, we even have like a dollar bill right here. Bubble wrap, whoa. And then this microscope right here, and then zooms in really far on them. Let's see. See, look, this is a dollar bill, really close. Look at that. See the number one right there? Whoa, so interesting. Oh, and then uh, let's see. That right there is bubble wrap, really close. Closer than what we can see with our normal eye. Whoa, look at that blue fabric. <sighs> looks like there's so much space right there. But when I look at it down here, kind of looks like a t-shirt. Whoa, and then, whoa, look at that. That is cardboard. Yeah, like cardboard, like a cardboard box. But that's really close. Whoa, pretty cool. <laughs> Microscopes are so cool. <laughs> okay, let's see what else is around here. Whoa, a place where you can draw, color, and write stuff. So today, let's take the color orange and write my name in these six boxes. Okay, ready? B, L, I, P, P, I. Flippy. <laughs> Good job. Okay, we'll keep that right there. Whoa, look at this. Wow, what a big green table. And there's some holes in it. Huh, I have an idea. Let's build something. Art doesn't just have to be pieces of paper that you draw on, or 
color on. It could even be something interesting like this. Wow. <laughs> okay, there we go. Perfect. Then let's try and connect all of these. Wow, look at that. Oh, I have an idea. Yeah, look at that. Wow. Oh, what a masterpiece this is. Oh, whoa! <laughs> oh, so silly. Whoa, this room back here, it's so interesting. Get ready, it's a little dark, but don't be scared. Wow, this is the fluorescent room. See, everything that you draw in here lights up and glows in the dark. Check this out. Ready? Let's spell my name again. B L I P P I. Yeah, good job. Flippy. Wow. <laughs> yeah, and we'll do a nice little underline. Wee. <laughs> That was awesome! Whoa! <laughs> wow! Whoa. What an interesting room that was! Wow! That was so much fun playing and learning at the Discovery Children's Museum in Las Vegas, Nevada! If you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B L I P P I. Flippy! Good job! See you soon! Bye bye Meet Flippy! And today we're at Dig This in Las Vegas, Nevada! Whoa! Ha ha! And today, you and I are gonna learn about the word crush! Do you know the word crush? Yeah, it means to destroy, pulverize, and just smash things! <laughs> Come on, let's go! Wait a second, do you see what I see? Yeah, eggs. Whoa, three eggs. One, two, three. <laughs> I love eggs, but today I'm not gonna eat this egg. Today, I'm going to crush this egg. Ready? <laughs> okay, let's find some more things to crush. <laughs> Woo! Hey, look! <laughs> Whoa! Look at what it is! It's a soda can! I think we should crush this! But be sure to never try this at home. And the only reason why I'm gonna do it is because I have shoes on. Alright, here we go! things. That was awesome! Oh hey, perfect! Look at what it is! This is a watermelon. It looks like it's ready to be crushed. Oh! Are you ready? Oh! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! That's awesome! <laughs> yeah! Look! The watermelon <laughs> All right, let's see what else we can find and crush. Oh, wait a second. No way. There's a car right there. Let's crush the car. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Before I crush the car, I need to wear my safety gear. All right. Whoa. <laughs> I have a bright yellow. Safety vest. Perfect. All right. And then I got my hard hat and safety glasses. All right. Oh, oh, 
Wait a second. This needs to be perfect. Okay, here we go. Oh, -hoo -hoo. all right. Let's give it a whirl. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> trying to crush it, but it's not really working. Let's try the door. <laughs> oh, interesting. Uh, I'm not getting very far. All right, one last one. <laughs> All right, anywho, I have an idea. We need a bigger tool for this job, but before that, Let's write crush on it! Perfect! Alright, we have some spray paint. We have red, green, blue, pink, and black. So first, let's take some white paint. Alright. Pour some in right there, and let's and let's give it a nice white base coat. All right, <laughs> yeah, woohoo, yeah. There we go, perfect. A little bit more white right there. All right. this. So, let's get a big machine for this. Ha ha! And the perfect machine is a toy excavator. Whoa! What better machine to destroy and crush this car than an excavator? But wait a second. This toy can't do it. <gasps> That's why I have a real excavator! Alright, let's crush this car! Hey, first things first, let's keep this toy excavator right back there. Let's put on our headset. Alright. Perfect. Alright, and now let's put on our hard hat. Okay, so let's take our safety belt. Yeah, just like the seatbelt in your car. 
now that we're all strapped in, we are ready to crush. I'm an excavator, excavator, hey dirt, see you later, I'm an excavator, I've got a great big arm and a great big boom, if I start digging now I'll be done real soon, I'm a dirt separator, I'm an excavator. Hey, 
it's time to act like an excavator. I'll teach you. All you gotta do is bring up your arm, like it's the arm and the boom in the bucket, and start to scoop. <laughs> That's fun! I've got a place where workers sit, it's called a cab Where they control the bucket to scoop and grab I'm a whole regulator, I'm an excavator Oh, can't you see that I work all day? Do you ever sleep? No time for sleep, no time for play I'm an excavator, excavator, hey dirt, see you later, I'm an excavator, excavator, excavator. Whoa! That was so crazy! in that car. Let's go check it out. Come on. Whoa! Look! Look the letters. C R U S H. Crush. Whoa, look at it. It's so crushed. Whoa. Here's the steering wheel. Whoa. And the seats and the windshield. Wow. That was crazy! Well, thank you so much for learning about the word crush with me. And hey, special thanks to Dig This in Las Vegas, Nevada. Well, see you later, kids. Bye bye! <laughs> hey! My name's Blippi! What's your name? Whoa! I really like your name! Look at where I'm at! Whoa! I am at an ice skating rink. And this ice skating rink is the Kent Valley Ice Skating Rink in Kent, Washington. Whoa. Ooh, ice is so cold. Whoa. <laughs> it's really cold. But look at what I'm wearing. Yeah. These are ice skates. Whoa! Look! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I love ice skating rinks because you can ice skate, you can even play hockey. <laughs> Whoa! <gasps> What's this? Whoa! This? is a Zamboni! And today, you and I are gonna learn about Zambonis! Now let's learn a little bit more about the Zamboni. <laughs> Zamboni, hmm, what a silly name. Look, there it is right there. Let's spell Zamboni together, ready? Z-A-M-B-O-N-I. 
Zamboni. Zambonis are used to resurface the ice at the ice rink, the hockey rink. Whoa, huh, what an interesting looking machine. Can you see what shape it looks like? Yeah, it looks like a rectangle. <laughs> Do you see any other common shapes that Zamboni has on it? Yeah! The wheels and tires. They are circles. Hey, speaking of wheels and tires, come check them out. Whoa. <laughs> Looks like the tires have these little metal spikes in them. Do you see them? Boop, 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 boop. These spikes are used to dig into the ice and grip the ice so then the Zamboni doesn't slip and slide when it drives on the ice. Whoa! <laughs> All right, let's see what else this Zamboni has. Oh, hey! This is the dump tank. When all the ice gets pushed up to the front, this is where all the ice shavings go. It's kind of like a giant snow cone. <laughs> All right, come back here. Whoa. This whole unit? This unit is the conditioner. And one cool part of the conditioner is right in here. Whoa. So there's like a razor blade down there that shaves the ice. It's really hard to see. But this, yeah, looks like a spiral. This is an auger that pushes all the ice to the center, then goes to the top, and then goes to the dump tank. Whoa. Whoa. And look at this. Here's some pipes. So what these pipes have, have water in them, and they spray water up, down, to the left, to the right, and then from there, the water goes on the ice, and then it melts and makes it really smooth and flat. Okay, watch this. Whoa! <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> all right, I think it's time to turn on the Zamboni. See these? These are propane tanks. This is what powers the Zamboni. All right, let's fire it up. Turn on the key. Whoa! All right, check this out. in the back. Okay, but come over here. It's really loud because that is the motor. Whoa. That's what provides the Zamboni with all of its power. Ooh, and right here, this is the water tank. <laughs> That's where the back of the Zamboni gets all of its water from. All right, I'm gonna go resurface the ice rink.
a board brush. It goes at the base of the board all around the ice rink and pushes all and everything in the middle for the augers and the blades to then get pushed atop to the forward and then you can recondition the ice. Wow! Board brush! Whoa! This is the pro shop. This is where you get all of your hockey gear. Whoa, hockey sticks? So cool! All right, we'll look at those later. But right now, we need to sharpen my blades on my skates. All right, and this is the sharpening room. Wow, <laughs> so cool! All right, this is the blade master. Yeah, see this? There's metal on the bottom of this skate, and we need to sharpen it. This is the sharpening station. So let's put the skate right here. Slide this, tighten that just a little bit. Pull that up. Ah. Now, it's ready to sharpen. Okay, turn on the light. And then there was light. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Whoa. Do you see those sparks? Here we go. Whoa! All right. Whoa! Ah, that's sharp. All right. Now we're ready. <laughs> All right, let's go check out some hockey gear. Oh, some pads. Yeah, a lot of pads. Because ice is really hard. You don't want to fall down. Ooh, and some more pads. <gasps> Do you see what I see? Orange and blue hockey sticks. <laughs> no way. Look, the color orange. Yeah, in blue. Wow. Oh, hey, look. Here's two different kinds of hockey sticks. Do you see how they curve differently? See, this one curves that way. And this one curves that way. Wow. See? I'll give you an example. So you take this one and you fling the puck this way. Because it curves that way. But this one, it curves the other way. So you fling the puck that way. Oh, hey, look. A perfectly placed hockey puck. <laughs> All right. Hey, I got the perfect stick. I got my skates. And I got the hockey puck. So now, let's go play some hockey. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. All right. Now that we have our hockey stick, yeah, and our hockey puck, another fun thing to do at ice skating rinks is learn to play. And maybe at your ice skating rink, they have learned to play as well, where you, as a child, can learn to play hockey. And the point of hockey is to get the puck using the stick into the hockey goal. Whoa, check it out. Whoa, this is the goal. Whoa, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> so what you do, like I said, take the puck, and get it inside the hockey goal past this line with the hockey stick. All right, let's try it again. It's gonna be a little bit easier because normally there's a goalie right there. It's so much fun playing hockey! Because the puck slides on the ice just like my skates. Oh, I missed! That's okay. Because when you play sports, if you miss, you just have to try again. Like this. Woo! In 
and eventually you'll win. This right here is a specialty move. It's called a knuckle puck. You take the puck, put it down vertically like that, and give it a whack. For the next activity, I have a handle and a rope, and it's attached to the back of the Zamboni. And for this sport, I call it Zamboni Skating. All right, got it. learning about the Zamboni with you, as well as hockey, eh, <laughs> and ice skating. Special thanks to the Kent Valley Ice Center. Wow, what a fun time we had. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Okay. B L I. P-P-I, Blippi! Good job, Bye bye Today we're at Just Play in Issaquah, Washington. Hey! Hi, have fun. Thanks. Okay, come on. Okay, first things first, before we play, we need to take off our shoes. Now that they're in the cubby hole, whoa, we get a play. Whoa, look at this! This is the color white, and you can climb on it. Okay, that's scary, but so much fun. Woo! What are these? Hello! Look at this! You sit on these! And they're kind of like a swing! Whoa! Whee! <laughs> hey! Whoa! Whee! Okay. What's this over here? Wow! These are green and white. And these ones over here are pink and white. Oh! oh. Look it up here! Whoa. Come on. There's floating balloons up here! Wow! This room has giant colorful floating balloons! Whoa! Look at them! Whoa! 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 Whoa. This balloon is the color green. This balloon is the color red. This balloon is the color blue. This balloon is the color orange. And this balloon is the color yellow. Oh, oh hey, a pink one. Okay, I'm gonna go down the slide. Watch me, okay? I'll be right down. Okay, here I come, down the orange slide. Whoa! <laughs> so dizzy. Whoa, look up here. Wow! This is gonna be fun, come on. Wow! Look at this place. Whoa! Woo. Push the button, and then you put balls in here. And then they go to the top. Ooh. You see how it's full? Okay. And then you can stand underneath it. You want to stand underneath it? Okay. Get ready. Here we go. Three, two, one. Whoa! Good job.
Okay, stay right here. You wanna go through? Okay. There's a lot of colorful balls here. Whoa. Whoa. All right. Cannonball! Whoa. 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 Look at all of these colorful balls. Whoa. Whee! 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 Whoa! Whoa! We have red ball. Orange ball, green ball, blue ball, pink ball, yellow ball, brown ball! Whoa! 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 Look! Okay, let's see what else there is. This place is so colorful. Whoa! 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 All right, follow me. Okay. okay, now we'll go this way. Wow, okay, I'm taking you to a blue slide. Come on. Wow, look at this. This is a blue slide. Okay, I'll go first, then you can follow, okay? Ready? Three, two, one. Whoa. <laughs> okay, your turn, come on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa, good job. All right, come this way, come on. Wow, good job. A giant chalkboard. Ready? Let's spell my name together. B L I P P I. Blippy. Okay. Come this way. It's a photo booth. So first. You put on some props, like this green hat, and this red guitar. Ready? Okay, here we go. Printing on demand. <laughs> That's so cool. All right, let's go, come on. Whoa, look at this. Hello. <laughs> wow, whoa, that mushroom house is so cool. Oh, okay, come here. Whoa, okay, come on. Let's go really fast. Okay. One, two, two, one, two, three. We're almost to the top. Okay, whoa. Look at these pyramids right here. Whoa. They have smiley faces on them with their tongues sticking out. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at this. Look at this spiky ball. Wow, there's pink spikes, blue spikes, green spikes. Okay, watch out. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, whoa. 
Get really close, come here. Check this out. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> I almost got you. Okay, come on. Whoa, look at this. It's like a balance beam. Whoa! And we're like two stories, three stories up in the air. Whoa, we're really high. Whoa. Oh hey, we're at the slide. The big blue slide. Okay. See you go down. Bye bye. <laughs> okay, you can go down first, okay? <laughs> Whoa, that looked really fun. Okay, my turn. Here we go. Whoa! <laughs> that was so much fun playing at Just Play in Issaquah, Washington with you. All right, bye bye Ooh, Hello! Whoa! Look at where we are. Today we're at Kids Time Indoor Playground in Las Vegas, Nevada. Woo! This is gonna be fun! Whoa! Rah, rah, rah. I'm just acting like a bear. <laughs> Whoa! Hello! <laughs> Here I come! Wow! Ooh! Come on! Whoa! Look up here! Wow! I wonder what's up here. But first... Whoa! Look at these walls! They're the color pink! Ooh! In this step, is the color light green, light blue, purple, yellow, white, blue, red, and green. Come on. Whoa, look at this. There's a bunch of balloons. And I have the magic remote. Let's push this button on the count of three. One, two, three! Whoa! Whoa! Look at him go! Whoa! Look at all the colorful balloons! Whoa! This balloon is the color yellow! This balloon is the color Red! <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Ooh. This balloon is the color pink! <laughs> Whoa! Okay! Look! This balloon is the color green! Whoa. And look at, oh, look, at the, look. look at these two. This is blue and this is orange. My two favorite colors. Okay, let's go. Those balloons were so colorful. Ooh, and what's this? Come on. Stay right here. Whoa! I am so excited! I'm gonna go jump inside. Come on. Whoa! 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 I'm gonna get out now. It's really bouncy. All right, let's see what 
else there is. Here we go. Ooh. Wow, look at this. These are monkey bars. Because then you can hang on them and act like a monkey. <laughs> Come back out. Whoa. Here I go. Whoa. 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 <laughs> I'll come back down. Oh, because there's slides behind me. Okay. Yeah, let's go slide down the slide. Whoa, look at this. Nice green slide. Ooh, let's climb up the ladder. Oh, oh, this is so tricky. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I'm gonna get down. Wow, that was fun. Okay, let's go up the ramp. So then we can get to the top and slide down the slide. I see you! Whoa. Hey! <laughs> okay, let's go down the slide now. Are you ready? Here I go! One, two, three! Whoa! <laughs> that was so fast! Here's some more slides. rock wall. See these rocks? Yeah, you can grab them and then put your feet on them and then you can climb to the top. All right, here I go. Whoa. 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 <laughs> yeah. Okay, now we should go down the green slide. Are you ready? All right. One, two, three. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa. Ooh, there's even more slides. Hey, yeah, look at this slide. Let's not do this slide. Whoa! Let's go to that one. Whoa! Look at that slide. It's fully enclosed and it's a spiral. Let's go down. Whoa! <laughs> Woo! Let's play some basketball now. This is a basketball hoop. And you take a basketball and you put it in the hoop. But wait a second, we need a basketball. Oh, yeah, right here. We have one basketball. We have two basketballs. Now we have three basketballs. Let's put the balls down right here. And let's take the first basketball and put it in the hoop. Ready? Yeah! Woo! That was under the leg! All right. Now, let's take the second basketball and put it in the hoop. Ready? Yeah! That was awesome! Alright. 
Now, let's take the third basketball and let's put it in the hoop. Here we go. Yeah! Did you see that? That was amazing. Okay, now that we played a bunch of basketball, I'm getting kind of hungry. Let's come in here and make some food. Lemon. <laughs> Yum! Ooh, and a pear. Ooh. <laughs> All right. Oh, hey. Some strawberries and grapes. Put them in there. Let's make some more food. Come on. Whoa. Just wash our hands. Some yummy fruit. Um, num, 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 num. Ooh, and some more. Oh. Whoa. Look, an apple and a pear. Yum. <laughs> okay, close the doors. Take the skillet. Put it back. <laughs> Let's go. game for us to play. Come here. This is what's called a connect four and it's giant. I'm gonna be yellow and you are gonna be red and the object of the game is to connect four in a row. All right, ready? I'll go first. <laughs> hey, your turn. Here you go. There's red. Put it anywhere you want. Ooh, all right. I'll go right here. Okay, you're red. Here you go. Oh, good job. Okay, I'm yellow. Okay, you're red. Here you go. Ooh, good job. Okay, oh, oh, it's getting close. Okay, here you go. Oh, you won! Good job! You connected four, look! Amazing job! Come on! Oh, it's like a bridge! Whoa! <laughs> oh, that was so much fun playing at Kids Time Indoor Playground in Las Vegas, Nevada with you. Well, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make a learning fun.